Guys, guys, I'm here, and I see one, two, threes. You, you guys didn't even give me an opportunity to say uh, what we should do it for. So can we get some uh, one, two, threes spammed in the chat if this should be the stream where I uh, blow my face off? I think that'd be kind of cool, be kind of different. I don't think you guys would be expecting that, so. Can I get your permission, guys? Can I see some one, two, there we go. There we go. See, now that's all I needed. Now that I've got people pressuring me into doing it, uh, I think I'm going to make nut on this stream, guys. This is it. Not really. Unfortunately for you guys, I'm going to have to talk into the microphone for two hours and not be very entertaining. Well, to some people. Uh, anyways, let me see what chat's saying other than the, the one, two, threes. I see a do a flip, uh, no balls, <laughs> apple pie pie apple said, well, guys, I guess that's it. Well, that's, that's terrible. A plug man says, a, a Mick what? Yeah, uh, look up Ronnie McNutt. You'll learn everything you need to know. What else we got? Flip the switch. Uh, Depressin said, Rogue flips a coin every stream, whether or not this is the stream where he dissects his own balls. Yeah, I thought we'd go ahead and do that, and the only way I'm going to be able to grit my teeth through it is I'm going to probably bite down on the hand that I'm not using to slice open my testes. So I'm thinking maybe I'll bite down on one of my, my knuckles. Maybe on my left hand since I'm right-handed. Might be kind of cool. Might not be. Might hurt. But either way, we got a few more minutes. We're fully ready to go, so just go ahead and, uh, wait, hold on. We need to pick a song to play. Uh, hmm. Well, I mean, it only makes sense to play this one. If I don't, I mean, I'd, I'd be kind of an asshole. Anyways, I'll be right back. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Somebody said to play the racist DuckTales theme song. I can do you guys one better. Give me a minute. I made a discovery in my downloads folder last night, and I'm going to share it with all of you before we start. Get ready. I hope you guys like flutes. Gotcha, bitches. I bet most of you were expecting to hear something about a certain fast food establishment and a uh, certain uh, fruit. Was I right? I bet a few of you were. But uh, yeah, yeah, somebody said it seems good, but uh, something's a little off. I know. It, it feels almost like uh, getting fucking blue balls, you know? You expect that fucking punchy racism and then don't get it. And it jumps right into the uh, chorus, I guess you could call it. Ooh. Ah, uh, my nuts hurt now. Either way, I think I need to go ahead and, uh, you guessed it, I'm gonna flip that switch. Ah. Uh. Okay, I think we're good to go. Intro is disabled. Asterisk, they can't hear you. Now they can. Say something for me. Happy Saturday. It's Hi. Saturday. Oh, Ugh, oh my it's, god, It's so good. It's such a good day. You know how good it is, Asterisk? Is it good? Is it good? How good is the day, right? Uh, I, I have no fucking idea. It's only the 21st, wow. uh, 21st day or night, I guess, of October. So We have, like, what, like, nine more days until, like, the spooky, spooky day. day? Yeah, Ooh, yeah. The day where exciting. I answer the door butt naked. <laughs> People don't know what to do. Trick! Yeah. <laughs> Fucking asking for tricks and treats. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. I answer the door buck naked with a 12 gauge. You get balls. <laughs> you get you get uh, a pair of nuts and then little balls coming out of the slug shells. You're just... It's done. But the shotgun shells are, are filled with little balls and the, the children are going to die. But oh, the rest... No. <laughs> I mean, who else is going to be knocking on my fucking door, Astrid? I'm gonna traumatize. I'm, gonna I'm you know, I'm gonna traumatize <laughs> anybody who gets away. 
Oh. I'm gonna make sure one person's able to get away, but I'm gonna make sure they don't have Tell a phone. Tell the story, you know. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I want them. I want to become an yeah. urban legend of sorts. Oh my god! Imagine people you. sitting around and on Halloween, you know, talking about all the spooky stories they know. It's like, oh man, let me tell you about this guy who answers the door naked and shoots children. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. God damn. In fact, the candy's wow, asked, wow, what wow. if uh, what if Pro is at the door? Well, then I'd have to be careful because he'd probably tear me apart. Oh um, wow. <laughs> Just the mess says Rogue lives in Stillwater perpetually. It's with one L, bitch. Uh, Plugman says one two three in the chat. If a Rogue has a CP folder, you better not put one two three in the chat because that's not true. You motherfucker! Why would you say that? That's that's evil. Good that's Lord. life ruination. Asterisk. Actually, four tonight. five six in the chat. If Asterisk has a CP folder, do not no. I would laugh if it flooded with four five sixes. But it's gonna be one you. two three. Uh, <laughs> I hate my life. Protogen Jazz said uh, Zach died. Well. Rip, I guess. I, I don't know what you want me to do about it. I'll send some flowers. Okay, see, it's a healthy mix of both. We're just both terrible people, Asterix. Someone out there cool. is going to... Li tastes like butt. Well, you fucking made it. Why does it taste like shit? It's Folgers. Oh, that explains... <laughs> don't get Folgers. It tastes like tobacco. I'm fucking pissed. God I'm still going to it, though. Mm. I digress. Asterix, um, we have things to look at. Yes. Uh -huh. I know. We have things to look at. <laughs> you know, after we looked at Chris on that off the cuff, uh, Chris put out another mm. thing. And uh, do you want the truth or you want lies, Asterix? I would love lies. Nothing more. It's a really good video that tells us a lot oh. about everything that's going on. And it's very I informative. We we learn everything. Does Realize he admit that. that he fucked his mom? Um. The answer is yes, bro, because you're lying to me. Oh, yeah, that's right. You know, I didn't really know how to break the news, but, uh, yeah, yeah, I, I don't oh, think, God. I don't think he ever fessed up to fucking dear old mommy. This is going to be so, so hard. I can't wait. So it's going to be great. But before we look at that, we need to look at some tweets he put out. Uh, mm. he's got some interesting shit to say. Um, from what I have found, like there's several tweets, but not all of them are interesting. Uh, he's still complaining about my little pony generation five, this G5 mm -hmm. shit. And he's also still very upset about, uh, well, I guess not also, but, or still, really, but he's not happy about this whole Ukraine shit. And he's got some interesting things to say. So let me share my screen to you. And, uh, okay. and also, guys, we will be doing an Argol tonight. So if you have any good ideas, put them in the chat, and we'll try to keep our eyes peeled for it. Asterix, do you see my screen here? Unfortunately. Oh, <coughs> yeah, that's how you know we're off to a fan motherfucking tastic start. Oh, uh, where was I? Okay, so they. I'm clear my throat. <coughs> Sorry. Good job. You're very good at cleaning, <laughs> clearing out your throat, Asterix. I'm very proud Thank of you. Thank you so much. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, you, you did a really good job. Next time, put a little bit more uh, effort into it, a little bit of elbow grease and phlegm. Can oh, I can do it, it now. Are you ready? <laughs> right, in, right into the microphone. Boost up the gain right into the microphone. <laughs> No, I know. No, 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 no. I'll no. do it. I'll do it. I've, I've got a little bit of drainage. Ah. I, ew, ew. I don't want to hear about okay, your drainage. Okay, so <laughs> TV screen is on. Let's hold on. Fuck me. I need to close out one thing. Okay. Uh, Astrid, you still see my screen? I am sorry. I still see your screen. It's okay. Good. I understand. Good. No, yes. you don't, yes. actually. So TV okay. screen is now on. Uh, getting a little peek here. We'll zoom in. So, we have this initial tweet from Equestria Daily, saying the G5 mm -hmm. comic, Black, White, and Blue, has officially released today. I love how many side series we are getting for the comics lately. Go check it out, blah, 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 and this link. And if you care about that, you can go there if you can see it. Chris, being the CPU goddess, had to come in with his intelligence, you know, his fucking astute observations, and he's going to tell you what's serious about My Little Pony. Nobody cares for MLP G5. Resume friendship is magic already at Hasbro, please. I literally foreknew and foretold how premature and awful G5 was to be. Hashtag psychic powers. Hashtag avatar. Hashtag Jesus Christ is right here. So, I forgot that Chris is also Jesus Christ Chan. How could and you forget? I don't know how I forgot. I'm a terrible Christian, Asterix. <clears throat> terrible, terrible Christian. But he didn't I stop understand. there. The Lord and Savior had much more to say about My Little Pony. Still have not watched any of My Little Pony G5 at all. And I never shall until after My Little Pony Friendship is Magic Season 14 Episode 26 is aired on... <laughs> fucking sorry. Is aired on TV, <laughs> streaming services, and all... Louder. Hasbro. 
here at Hasbro. I'll make this easy for you. So heed my input and do it here. Hire every one of G4 cast and crew back. And then, John Delancey as Discord. Start with Discord telling everyone G5 is undone and resume G4 from there. Definitely get Faust back on as well. Nightstar and I are more than happy to help personally. Well, I'm glad that Chris is... Chris has got it all figured out, and he's willing to give a fucking helping hand. That's exciting. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, that might mm -hmm. actually get me well, to watch the know. shit. Oh, well, there you go. We'll, we'll make Rogue into a brony yet. I mean, really, how I different could the generations be? I, from what I understand, like, none of the characters are there. It's all new. It's like, it's like a whole new world, whole new, like, animation, all that shit, you mm -hmm. know? So everybody obsessed with like touching their dicks to like the 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 cute little cartoony ponies that are like drawn are are all pissy and the ones that don't give a fuck are just moving on with their lives I guess you know what I mean Yeah, someone in chat pointed out that there's not even fourteen seasons. There's there's nine Is there seasons. Not? I don't know. That's what they said. I'm going to the take their word fuck for it. Is Chris talking about? Oh, I I bet I bet at this point, Chris has probably gone on and like written. Uh, you know, like uh, like seasons oh, yeah. in his yeah. head. Yeah, instead of writing Sonichu, you know? he's written fucking My Little Pony fan fiction. He's on his own fucking timeline at this rate. Damn, <clears throat> I, I can't believe it, Asterix. This is serious shit. But moving along, we got another one here. So uh, Miss <laughs> Carrie Kruger um, tweeted at him saying, "What's your input on what's going on in Israel?" So you know we're gonna get some really interesting shit here. Mm -hmm. uh, Chris said, demons and devils are literally at work on both sides there. Also, Putin shall die by his own sword. I heavily support and supported Ukraine in defenses amidst my work. And the Ukraine girl sitting by POTUS, Lisa Simpson, in the circle meditation drawing in a church in Israel with that church's Israeli priest there leading on the circle. They don't have priests, right? I don't think so. That's what isn't I thought. That, isn't that? That's a whole different, like, thing. Yeah, yeah. Was what? an escape what? from that. Oh, wait. Was an escape from that World War Three that Lisa adopted. Okay. Escapee. Oh, oh escapee, rather. I see, yeah, I see. yeah, yeah, yeah. So I, yeah, I, I, I don't know. I, I don't think he really understands the Jewish faith. But then again, I don't either. So Lisa Simpson is in a meditation circle with an Israeli priest, uh, along with their adopted World War Three orphan child from Ukraine. Yeah. Okay. 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 Everything makes a lot more fucking sense now. Now, I, I got some questions, you know, like I've, I've watched my fair share of The Simpsons and Lisa is typically depicted as an intelligent president. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't think we have that right now. I, last time I checked, our president is not Lisa Simpson. And the direction of this country is um, questionable. Not saying Lisa would do a very good job either. You know, she's like, what, eight? But still. She's a cartoon. Yeah. She <laughs> well, Doesn't I mean, matter. we have, we, no, no, asterisk. You got to account mm. for the fact that there's a parallel universe. Oh, I Lisa's see, real see, in our hearts, but I, I know see, see. I know who I'm voting for next election. Mm -hmm. Do mm -hmm. you? Have you chosen Asterix? I'm I'm scared to look. I've been talking to Pro a little bit recently, and he's been discussing oh, uh, ideas he's had for political aspirations. And we, uh huh. You know, I think I might support that Asterix. I might fund his campaign. Would Chad like that? Oh, Would they like a, a Pro Panky for President campaign? <clears throat> I think Pearl we can make that. like wear a suit for longer than like thirty seconds. Okay? It doesn't matter if we if we get it dirty. <laughs> maybe get a man uh, to piss uh, on it. He might be into like, it. Like tear it up. Yeah, yeah. tear it up. <laughs> Throw it to the wall. A little bit. Hell yeah. Just light it on fire <laughs> for all of it. like ten seconds, and that'll be what's left. Jesus fucking Christ! Wait. <laughs> Again, this is this is what uh what uh, what Zach could have been. Have you heard from him? He just like totally vanished for me. Oh, I, well, my, my microphone apparently was muted, even though I, it wasn't flashing. But no, I haven't heard from him. Goodness. Well, I mean, that answers the chat's questions, but <clears throat> I'll support pro. I don't care. I mean, this this this, this, this country's going to hell anyway. Oh, yeah. let's, let's have fun with it, you know? I think it'd be interesting, if nothing else. We've already got one homo in <laughs> office. Let's get another one in there. What could Nutty go wrong? Nutty Buddy in chat said, uh, propane key for president. He makes gay sex mandatory. <laughs> I, I bet he would. I wouldn't doubt I it. I believe it. Well, that's a good idea there. The one V had art goal, the 2008 Obama hope poster, but it's propane key. I like that idea. Oh, I could do it. We, we could make some it. campaign shit. There's a lot of potential oh my here. God. But I digress. Let me move on to the videos of Chris. <clears throat> uh, <clears throat> let's see. So we have two videos. We have setting the record straight, talking about okay. Barbara, and then we have a Christmas play. Even though, uh, well, Christmas is a few months away. 
Real you like Christmas, now, Asterisk? Yeah. yeah. Are you a fan I... of Christmas? I'm okay with Christmas. It's it's, it's a good jolly season. I Astrid, love me some Do you some, see that thumbnail on the lower right there? Do you, do you see that? I see that, yeah. Why is it? There's a swastika in that thumbnail. <laughs> He's got a little Hitler on there. They gave a little Hitler statue. I, I want to show this to Chad. Hold on. Let me get the magnifier. <clears throat> oh, good Hey, Chad, check this out. So, <laughs> look, look, look at this shit. I click on the thing, you know, and I'm trying to, I'm trying to keep a good, healthy stream here. And then there's just a fucking swastika. Now, see, my videos get demonetized if I, I put a little character with a gun in it. But this fucker mm -hmm. gets 42,000 views with a swastika. So, son of a bitch. That's how you Jesus. know it's a, it's a video that has a lot of nice things to say. We gotta change our direction, obviously, you know? Yeah, yeah, obviously. Yeah, this, this channel is now a Nazi channel. Oh no. <laughs> All right. Anyways, so let's see what Chris has to say. I'm sure it's not going to be very very intelligent. Are you ready? I haven't even seen this. I'm very I'm very scared. I'm not. <clears throat> hey everyone. Hi hey, Chris. Chris Weston, Channel Sonic. You prime here. Right now I'm going to set the record straight. So oh just so y'all know, straightforward and blunt to the point. Uh-huh. The reason I went to jail, the charge I was charged with. This hurts to listen to. Why does it hurt? It's it's like wavering back and forth. I feel like I thought <laughs> I've like just been punched. Yeah, the the audio mixing is not going to be great. Jesus so. fucking Christ! I Chen. was <laughs> innocent. There never, ever, ever, mm -hmm. ever, ever was any sense between Barbara and I. Period. I was innocent. Now, flat, let's let's rewind a bit. Um, mm -hmm. Didn't Chris e explain in detail what he did about like sticking his fingers into her and and yeah, doing it every like, three days? And like the comments about like her saying it was like better sex than anything like his dad ever did, you know, like yeah. hitting her G spot, you know, making her come. Just yeah, this was a little detailed. It was you know? a little too detailed, and there was he told too many people. Because I remember mm -hmm. Dylan asked him if it happened, and he confided in Dylan and said yes. Mm -hmm. There's just too many times where he said yes. And I refuse mm -hmm. to believe that it's just the trolls were telling him to do it, because it was a whole investigation. And mm -hmm. I got this sneaking suspicion that he's going to say that the charges were dropped because they just weren't true. When, in actuality, the case was just... It, the case fell apart because it's it's all mostly based off of hearsay... <clears throat> uh, not hearsay, but claims on the internet. Yeah. You know, it, it's hard to prove much of anything. That's why it fucking failed. Mm hmm I have a few bullet points to go through anyway. I miss you. I mean, where did we go to end up here? So, obviously... We it really sounds like they took a microphone that's recording in like in mm. dual channels or something and just sat mm -hmm. it right behind him. <laughs> like this is really, really, really bad. God. It's like they made like a Newton's cradle of like microphones and like had it swing back and forth the entire time he was talking. Fuck man, it's like a boom microphone Jesus. in the other room. Being like punched. <laughs> Why didn't just get a microphone, put it in the uh the front facing recording setup and just sit it in front of you? But what do I know? Start Star and speculation in the chat said, uh, is this Chris's attempt at gaslighting a true narc through and through? Yeah? Maybe. I, I don't well, know. We weren't there. I, I didn't see him fuck Barb. <laughs> I didn't see Chris fuck Barbara and stick his fingers oh, up in her you. old lady pussy, so I can't very, very well uh, verify it, Asterisk. I, I can't do it in that good faith. It makes me so queasy. I hate it. I'm sorry. What? Uh, just <laughs> what, fingers that, that Chris... and old lady pussy. Chris was fingering and eating out old mom? lady pussy. Oh yes, yeah, well that, that too. Yeah, it's his mom, me. but he went in there and he oh he stirred pussy Ugh. with his, his chubby little ree ree fingers. Ooh. Yeah, <laughs> Isn't that a terrible term, stirring pussy? Stirring pussy is gross. And really, they think of that one like mac and cheese video, you know? So much. Shut up. What? I mean, just. <laughs> That's a mess of good grief right there. That's another weird thing. Chad pointed out it looks moldy. Why is his medallion backwards? I... Is that a sign he's lying? He's being deceitful? Is this, is this like when like cops turn off their body cam? Like... <laughs> no, like, remember, Chris would, when in the past, yeah. when people would get him to say shit, he would put little subtle hints that he is, like, lying. When you talk about, like, gay shit, he would hold an Optimus Prime to make him stay straight. You know? Ooh. 
Or, really? Yeah, or there would be something wrong with his medallion. Mm-hmm. I don't remember exactly what he did, but he would have something off that would indicate that he's mm-hmm. not being true and honest. So maybe. Oh my God. Maybe he's there's flipped layers. and this is a side. Maybe there's somebody holding him at gunpoint and he's he's really scared, Asterix. Something could be wrong here. Oh no. I care oh for his God. safety. <laughs> Bibble said he's being untrue and dishonest. Look at that. He looks, he's scowling. He's not happy. Looks he's mad. also mumbling. He's mm-hmm. like, mm-hmm. Well, yeah, because he's fucking crazy. Pepper. They probably had him on all but, kinds of drugs when he was in, yeah, the, in yeah. the facility, and it probably turned his brain into dog shit. But it's also making me think of like, like when he was like forced to say stuff, like, uh, like, uh, like the blue spike um, stuff. Yeah, or you know? uh, yeah, because when know? he would uh, get him to say, "I'm, I'm gay," the uh, yeah. I'm gay, and uh. you know. Oh, and the, you know, uh, uh, I, the I can't getting, repeat it. <laughs> getting raped up the bunch, but by a bunch of uh, neighbors, friendly neighbors, people. Then, oh, at the end, neighbors. Demographics, statistics, <laughs> you know. You all really erroneously misunderstood me, period. Huh? I, 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 <laughs> and just, that was a whole mess up. Oh, yeah, see, chat knows that Chris is a gabian. Let me shoot. Even y'all, y'all, oh. your freaking smut fictions. I know, I'll num- I know He's some of you are making out of my too much mouth. eye contact, too, you know? Well, this is what it was like to be Barbara minutes before you got your, uh, your butthole stirred. Oh, yeah. You know, this is how he seduced her, just staring into <laughs> her, her soul, which has already been shaken <laughs> multiple times through years of living with him. Can you please stop, like, saying stirred with anything to do with sex? It's funny. Because that is so fucking gross. Did Chris actually, like, fuck his mom, or was it just all, like, hands and mouth shit? Did I we, don't did know. Did he take her to Pound Town? Did he turn that tailbone into dust? <laughs> did he stir pussy with his bent duck? Are the worst. <laughs> I bet if they fuck sideways, he'd be able to hit her G-spot real easy. Oh my fucking god, bro. That are the worst. That's he was all about it, Astrid. I know. She was all about it. When they pulled her into court, you know, she was saying, oh, that dick was good. That's why he got out. Good. Okay. Judge was like, oh, fuck, okay. We are in Virginia. I uh, am the minority. You've written those smut fin Just cut you Virginia off of the United States Barbara. and sent into the ocean. You shit me with that, sn- with that snow lights. And I've seen worse ship. And Barbara was definitely not the perfect mother with me. Just... No, but she she gave really good good head, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Barbara was really bad to me, but she fucked like a jackrabbit. <laughs> I bet she sounded like a dying moose when she got fucked. The perfect <laughs> mother daughter relationship. Good Lord, day, period. That was a, yeah. That mother daughter relationship always involves stirring mm-hmm. pussy. Yeah, oh up, my god! There was the times of abuse, even though there was the love and caring in there and throughout. But that was a whole different cow fish. <laughs> Love and care and fucking stuck. Uh, but yeah, the bullying, the terrorizing and all that, they really fucked me up. No shit. <laughs> no fucking shit. <laughs> okay, so there's the truth right there. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Good job. Well, we, we finally got an answer to the story. That That's going to be the end of the stream. We now understand why Chris is all crazy. All right, good night, guys. I feel so... <laughs> Asterix Bodacious said that uh, Barb can't squirt, dust blew out. Oh, fuck. Barb dusted. Just enough said right there. <laughs> One, two, three in the chat if you would <laughs> if, if you would hit Barb. Not, not, we're not talking hitting her in the mouth. We're, we're talking, I mean, if you want to oh. hit her in the mouth. One, two, three in the chat <laughs> no. if you want to assault an old woman. Four, five, six in the chat if you want to, if you want to have a sensual moment. Oh, my God. I better see a lot of one, two, threes. <laughs> someone said, No! <laughs> But Yank say Chris would be eating Barb like a professional pie eater. Oh god, Yo. it's gonna be like those videos of people eating watermelon slices real fast. <laughs> yeah, the... never gonna make me commit suicide. Period. And that was the attention that Bell. Cat moved too fast. I saw someone say, "I hate the elderly." I had all her chopped and screwed up recordings with all the attention and manipulating me into that. But hey, I foreknew she was gonna do that. I tested her at the time. I only, I treat her like, you know, just... What's he talking about now? Well, let me, let me go back a bit. I believe he's talking about yeah, Bella. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're never going to make me uh, commit suicide, oh. period. And that was... Well, that's good. I'm glad Chris is never going to end Hero. That would be a very sad <laughs> end to the story. <laughs> but before Chris doesn't kill himself, can he, uh, can he figure out how to use chroma key, please? So what God, please. Bella had 
and oh. all her chopped and screwed up recordings with all the attention and manipulating me into that. But hey, I foreknew she was going to do that. I but you didn't stop it. You, you, you thought, oh, well, I, I keep telling this woman on the internet about me fucking my mom and, and sticking my fingers inside of her and exploring. But uh, what could go wrong? I know she's going to talk, but how could it go wrong? It's it's so annoying when Chris is like, I knew this was going to happen. Blah, 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 blah. And then, like, <laughs> it's like, why did you fucking do anything, though? Why did you let, like, like time's uh, arrow flow in that direction? You know? Oh, like, yeah. what's your fucking problem? Yeah, Chris knew that eventually somebody was going to snitch about him putting on the mood lights and playing some fucking smooth jazz as he let his fingers explore her inner thighs. Good Lord. God. I tested her at the time. Buddha, what the I fuck like, are you saying in chat right like, now? You know, just... What? But I should say no in chat just said among gilfs, she is a 1.8 out of 10. There are better elderly people Chris could have targeted with his boomerang sausage. <laughs> boomerang sausage. What, what old woman uh, do you guys think Chris should try to plow next? Preferably not, <laughs> not assault. Like, what's an old woman that really Lee cool? Walsh. Yeah, he should try to go and fuck <laughs> Mary Lee Walsh. He should. Holy shit. Ooh, man, he should break that fucking spine. <laughs> Boy, he needs to hit that shit and paralyze her ass. As a friend, Don't say Jamie Lee Curtis. <laughs> Jamie, who said Jamie Lee Curtis? Who said Jamie Lee Curtis? <laughs> Nancy go, Pelosi, fucking... Hillary Clinton, Cher, <laughs> Biden, Cher. <laughs> Michelle Obama, <laughs> Mobility Mary, <laughs> Feinstein, Martha Stewart, Madonna, <laughs> Queen Fuck Elizabeth. Fuck you, whoever dead. said me. Fuck you. <laughs> oh my God, Rocky Shoemaker, <laughs> Hootie Beauty. Okay, we're oh we're gonna we're getting a variety of answers. Obviously, she failed. Just like I foreknew the relationship. Can we, Esther? Can we have an art goal where you? Re Jackson. <laughs> Michael Jackson. Michael Jackson. Esther, do you uh you remember the image where Chris was like a uh, fucking the three girls, the drawing? Or he's fingering oh, the... Yeah. Don't can, even ask. Can you can you remake that but with Chris and the Golden Girls? <laughs> Please. <laughs> That'd be a good art goal. I that's too funny to pass up, Rogue. That's that's too funny. I know Do I, I know you censor it. I know you have rules against drawing like sexual shit, but if we censored it, it would be hilarious. It's like those rules mostly apply to you and my characters and like people we cover, like just just to be safe, you know. But <laughs> I I can make a really big exception. If can Chad we make Betty White a Nazi? Enough. No, 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 Damn, no, 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 no. Between Dylan and <laughs> I know Taylor, I'm such a bitch. <laughs> that was not gonna last. He abused her. I gave her support on that live stream when I went on. Bang, there. bang, bang. I can't even support. keep like one headphone off to hear myself fucking talk because Chris's stupid channel keeps going back and forth. Yeah. Fuck you just have you. to endure it. You know, it's bad enough that Chris raped dear old mommy. Now he's got to rape our eardrums. Yeah, kindness, fucking I asshole. I appreciate her as an artist and an individual, which is more than I could say for Dylan at the time. Yeah, I know. I, I feel you. Dylan's kind of a dickhead. Uh, but yeah. <laughs> Bella was going to actually record me and Fifi having done something at the hotel. Had I Who the fuck is Fifi? Fifi was the uh, the girl that had an attraction to Chris. Where she wanted to fuck him. Uh, some autistic girl. Oh. I, I, oh. Is that who they were calling the Sutris? Was that the name they gave her? I forget. I don't know. I don't, I don't, I don't know. Maybe, yeah, the Sutris. Yeah, the somebody in chat said Sutris. Unfortunately, that mm -hmm. didn't quite happen. She, she, one way or another, she would have got me into jail or tried to get me to commit suicide on, on the whole different thing. Like but hey, she failed. She didn't do that. I took the initiative in my own hands. So mm -hmm. I let my, I let my, I let divine intervention and timing and everything mm -hmm. just send me, just let me go to jail, spend my time suffering and spending the time for your sins, you fucking, fucking toxic ones. Oh, oh there we oh. go, Asterix. There was a different word I'm sure he was going to use there, yeah, but like he was he was going to say a, a <laughs> really hard he was going to say the f word I think yeah. <laughs> he was he was either going to be that or it was going to be some kind of slur because he hesitated I heard, too hard I was hearing f you know, I was hearing the f you know. <laughs> yeah yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> Jesus fucking fucking Christ. fucking toxic ones not meditate and learn everything I am Jesus so he Christ thinks that this is little like like his resurrection yeah I mean this is the second coming of of Christ Chan. This oh. would be a great sticker.
that right there <laughs> or, or like 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 an emoji for chat or something straight up oh yeah <laughs> you that's a, that's an emoji we could use as the uh the cross symbol he made that'd be a good oh, emoji yeah i have i have plenty ready oh my fucking god oh shit Once. oh man i'm stupid <laughs> Not meditating, learned everything. I am Jesus Christ, me incarnated. Mm. I am the one. I'm glad it's also Jesus, Jesus? Christ. <laughs> yeah, Jesus Christ. <laughs> you guys heard it here first. Jesus is a Mexican. Avatar of all existence, and I'm gonna see that there is. Oh, wait, so it's Jesus good. Christ, Christian, <laughs> Christopher, Ricardo. <laughs> I, I can't. I that's can't. a long ass name, man. Christine. Oh my God. Yeah. This is like it's like saying like Daenerys Targaryen's full name, you know what I mean? Only worse. Good, period. Just like I'm trying to do in this video and statement right now, saying the record straight. But I was proven innocent, <laughs> and they couldn't Sorry. place me anywhere, which is why they kept me in jail. No, they they probably couldn't prove either or. That doesn't mean innocence. It just means that there's no proof. You know, like if I shoot someone, asterisk, and mm -hmm. I find them on the ground. You know, I, I leave them and we we come back later and I show you this body. And be like, oh my god, what the fuck happened? Now, mm -hmm. if I was the only person in that room and then when we come back later they died, would you assume that I probably did it? But could you prove it? I don't know and I don't think I could. Exactly, but you could deduce the person's dead because they're on the ground bleeding. You could maybe find the caliber of the bullet that was used, but you wouldn't yeah. really be able to prove that it was me unless you find the fingerprints on the bullet, on the, uh, bullet or there's a gun nearby, something. So mm -hmm, they know, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. they know Barbara was probably fucked, but they probably can't prove it. Now they have the testimony, but then again, it was part of a trolling operation. All of their testimonies are coming from people on the internet, mainly faceless, nameless people. Mm -hmm. Of course it's going to fall apart. Chris is the Teflon tart, it, nothing sticks. Yeah, I mean, honestly, fucking, I don't know, man. Yeah. <laughs> Leiloni said, that's, uh, that's me trying to dodge charges. That's me in court talking about murder. Like... He he wasn't even like he wasn't even found not guilty. The case was dismissed. Mm -hmm. He 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 has no fucking legs to stand on here. Yeah. It doesn't even matter, you know. Yeah, it, it's just it's complete fucking bullshit. Good Good for so long because they didn't know what to do with me. They didn't know what to do with somebody was freaking autistic that you weren't but you were more. Ish. They didn't know what to do. They just kept me in jail. They just they didn't know where to place me. But fortunately, they did know. No, they put you in jail because your court case was ongoing. Mm -hmm. That happens. <clears throat> you know, you, you can be in, you can be locked up while you're being tried. That's kind of how the criminal justice system works. You weren't bailed mm -hmm. out. I, I don't think he even had bail, did he? No, I don't think so. Yeah. Don't replace me eventually. So that happened. I'm Somebody has to try to think he'd be retried for okay. the, uh, despite the dismissal. <sighs> Mm -hmm. But I did nothing I, yeah, wrong, I don't and think only he, the certain there's a reason why he online. couldn't be. Yeah. They had wrongfully manipulated and controlled me and my own narrative for <laughs> no more. I take control of my own narrative from now on, not you. Michael and Chuck. Not you, yeah. God, <laughs> if you can't find the unclit, then you must acquit. That's pretty good. I am a much better individual than that. Y'all should have known better than me in that than... That is enough with the mislabelings and the misconceptions. Just, that's enough. And the whole lot of the sets commentary was me being misled by the suggestion of those individuals. I really feel like he's reading something. Yeah, he's reading something. There's no doubt about mm -hmm. that. And mm -hmm. he's trying to interject mm -hmm. his own thoughts. Uh, I think he's probably just got bullet points or something that he's briefly looking yeah. at. Uh, the thing is, Chris, even if you're coerced, you still would have... And we're just going to assume that Chris is telling the truth here, right? Mm -hmm. Even if you're coerced to do something, if you still do it, it's a crime. If I tell yeah. Asterix, there's somebody I really don't fucking like and I want them taken out and then I convince her to kill them, does that mean mm -hmm. that she's guilty? No. It, it, it just doesn't work that way. I don't, I don't get this logic. Like even Chris, yeah. usually Chris isn't even this fucking stupid. Like, good God. She does. Obviously, there's there's still troll intervention. People are still fucking with them behind the scenes. Theoretical X is a mm -hmm. mine. And I was proven innocent by court of law and released. Simple as that. And also, just putting this out there, just do not be enablist. I mean, those of you neurotypical, 
thinking you're able, whatever, there is at least one thing that is totally disabled about you, period. Mm -hmm. So don't, do not hate. No, there is a lot about you, though. Others for things that I'm you disabled now. Yeah. <laughs> you're, you're all f disabled. Okay. <laughs> Fuck, where's my fucking check then, asshole? Where's my tugboat? <laughs> where's Fuck. my social security? Oh my yeah. god. Period. Good lord. Why do I have to wait to get my fucking social security? Yeah. He's not there looking no in the same direction. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I'm waiting for his eyes just to go in different directions next. One. <laughs> or even yourself. <laughs> a flaw is a flaw. A blessing is a blessing. And a flaw can be a blessing in disguise. So you met. Oh, so you that. fucking your mom is a good thing, I see. I'm easily manipulated. And, and you know, that that is a flaw, but at least I got pussy. Fucker. Ew. Oh, man. <clears throat> for such a flaw. And I am a living, breathing... Depressed, and I'm pretty sure it was just straight dismissed. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, they, they could try to do something, but odds are, if they didn't find anything then, they're not going to find anything later. Unless we get, like, mm -hmm. photographic evidence that Chris fucked Barb, there's really not much they could do. Individual, and I am or like a not sex tape or something, you know? Yeah. in any way yeah. anymore. <sighs> yeah. But yeah, in that Bella was the real sets criminal. Chris isn't that a virgin. She really wanted to try to get me in something. She's a real criminal. I don't think. No, he had sex with Mia Hamm, the uh, the yeah, prostitute. Yeah, the hooker. Yeah. Yeah. Fucking Billy. No, Chris Reber. Calling her out. <laughs> Calling her out. Isabella Jenkins. She's the real sets criminal. Period. <laughs> Isabella Jenkins. She did a whole mess of adulteration Isabella and manipulation Jenkins, that's and things in her own words. I like that's really good. And everything. <laughs> okay. But to end this on a more positive note, so... The now, this is going to be important, Asterix. Listen very closely. The girl y'all okay. have seen me with in the past few weeks, I'll tell you a little something about her. She's a friend of mine, and I refer to her only as Flutter. Oh, God. Where do you think that name came from, Asterix? Uh, horse! <laughs> horse. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> because she likes Fluttershy, okay? Oh, wow! <laughs> wow! <laughs> What the fuck do I win? <laughs> she got in touch with me while I was in jail. And we managed to meet. We managed to bond and connect with each other as friends. Yeah, and she got a transfer. <laughs> What's up? What do you, so he said they, mm -hmm. she made contact with him while they were in jail. Mm -hmm. Do you think that there's a possibility she's a troll? <laughs> Is it at all possible? Oh, oh no, no, there's no way. No, 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 no. What if we have no, a weirder no. scenario? What if this is another Fiona? What if this person wants him? What if this woman is also very mentally ill? Definitely uh -huh. disabled. Yeah, mentally disabled. Intellectually disabled. And mm -hmm. uh, maybe he found his match. I don't know. I, I, I need to know, like, how they establish communication, you know, stuff like that. But... Like, my first thought was, I mean, we, we kind of went over this. Like, we thought it was, like, a caretaker or, like, a halfway home kind of thing. And even when I heard that uh, they met in jail, I thought it was maybe, maybe, maybe being me and hoping that this isn't more fucking trolls. Um, I figured it was some kind of, uh, what was it? Like, pen pal kind of thing. Like, like right to an inmate. Yeah. But, no, I, I uh, yeah, this is, this is another Either problem. any outcome is terrible. If she's fucked up and she was in the system because of things that happened to her, things are going to get a lot worse for her. If she's a troll, mm -hmm. her days and her her safety is numbered. The days oh, yeah. of her safety is are, are just numbered at this point. Mhm. Mm mm -hmm. And she is literally 30 years old despite the way despite her physicality. But anyway. But he was about to say something there but they cut it. So, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. so who knows? But notice he says but her physicality. And connect with yeah. each other as friends. And she is literally 30 years old despite the way, despite her physicality. I'm Why do you need to she bring that up? She could also just be lying. She could be lying about her age, too. I mean. Yeah. But, but I don't understand why he feels necessary. Like, people saw her and said, oh, wow, she looks young, but she's not a kid. Why do you need to no, specify no, no, no. it? That's creepy. That's really <laughs> fucking creepy. But anyway, just pretty much straightforward right there, letting you know about that. And I just felt like I just need so to So my thing is, if they cut something hair, from this, 
mm-hmm. like his editors or whatever, either that means that to me, that's two possibilities. One in that they're possibly just being nice and just cutting personal information that Chris babbles on about. Or mm-hmm. two, that Flutter Girl is in on it. Maybe. That would be yeah. exciting. Oh, God damn. What if... <laughs> What if he takes her out somewhere? You know, he goes to Walmart and the mm. pickle man comes back. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh I wish. I the wish, return I of the I pickle wish. man would be fucking incredible. Please. <laughs> Can we just get the pickle away. man and Clyde one more time? Come on. Oh, my God. No. There is nothing the wrong with being associated with me, period. I am sick and tired of being blocked by anyone, including and especially by those of whom I appreciate, and I do have friends that do have. He's great mad because Tara Strong blocked him. Which boy? I mean, she's been having a pretty interesting <laughs> few <laughs> months, really, yes. few, few weeks on uh, Twitter. I've been, I've been keeping an eye on that. She's saying oh. a lot of shit that's making a lot of people <laughs> mad. <laughs> and all I can, all I can think of is all these cartoon characters and shit to saying terrible things now. That girl, Gotta love it. She can sit on her laurels for the rest of her fucking life. You know? Oh man. More than oh, I can fuck. say than some. I mean, you all the even pickle man treats me again. Your chance <laughs> to actually be kind and compassionate and friends with me for a longer run. Well, uh, chat's asking. Uh, Tara Strong was like tweeting about like uh like pro Israel stuff, right? Yeah, or, or one of the other. I one of the it's, other, and, and, she, and, and whichever Israel. one, and whichever one she was supporting, she absolutely vehemently decries the opposite side. And mm-hmm. people will argue mm-hmm. with her in comments, and she blocks people. It's uh, been mm-hmm. interesting to watch. And plus, um, I think she got thrown off some, like, I don't know if, it, if it's indie or a big thing, but some cartoon, and she blamed it on being, like, a Jew. <laughs> so. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God, of course. Tara's of fucking course. herself real hard. Everybody's anti-Semitic. Oh, fuck. Oh, that's enough said right there. Twilight Sparkle loves war. I need to get that off. I'll let mm. them out of a sleepless night. Well, there you go. Does this look like somebody who is just mentally there, Asterisk? If Chris, I'd want if, if this Chris, person to do my taxes. Oh yeah, <laughs> if Chris has any sin, like level of cognizance. It's very, very basic. It's primal because Chris seems mm-hmm. even less lucid than the last video we saw. Mm-hmm. Chris is either on medication or he's he's off of it and he's all loopy because of it. Maybe he's medicated. Could here. be. He's he's medicated now. He could be going through withdrawals too. Oh. If they gave him something to treat something underlying that we don't know about and he's withdrawing, that could make the symptoms of the like mental shit way worse. Bruh. Oh my god, Rogue. Yeah, there you go. Oh See, things are getting exciting, Asterisk. Let me pull up the next one. Up. We're gonna skip through this one a fair bit. Uh mainly because it's not that fucking interesting, but it's worth oh, briefly god. poking at. So, Asterisk, we were talking about Christmas earlier. You, you said you're mm-hmm. a fan of Christmas. You like that time of the year. I love that. You know, festive. Yeah. Ho, 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 all that, uh, you yeah. know. Yeah, ho, ho, fucking ho. And mm-hmm. uh, <clears throat> TV's on for them. Give me a second. There we go. TV's on for him. Let's take a little peek. It's mainly going to be him talking in front of a camera, and I don't really, don't really care. Mm-hmm. Oh, Christ alive. The Life and Times of Jesus Christ, a Christmas play by Angelica Rose Chu. <laughs> so, we need to look at all this <laughs> shit. So, the narrator, Holy Ghost Angel, Angelica Rose Chu. Three wise men are played by Night Star, Inuyasha, and Perceptor. Joseph is played by. Joseph. <laughs> Can't <simple to> <laughs> the Young Jesus slash Little Drummer Boy is played by <laughs> Danny Sony. <laughs> Uh, fucking Mary, or uh, young Rizelna. Mary Magdalene is R- Razel, Razelna. <laughs> Razelna! <laughs> Fuck. Virgin Mary is played by Kristalina Rose Chew, and King Herod and Satan are played by Jams to Sonic Chew. Jams <laughs> Disciple Peter is Punchy Sonic Chew, so he's Asian. Lazarus <laughs> and uh, John the Baptist are Wild Sonic Chew. Elizabeth slash Anna slash. Uh, Pharisee woman is uh, Bubbles Rose Chew. And who, who could forget Judas, no. played by Cal Sonic Chew. Perceptor's playing Cal. another person. It's just, it's going great. I thought this said Barbara, and I thought we were going to get something really cool. <laughs> Fucking Christ. James is played Either by... Inu- 
<laughs> Inuyasha Sonichu. What does that mean? It's a Sonichu form of Inuyasha, Astrid. Oh, fucking goddamn. Is there Inuyasha shit in the Sonichu canon? Like, at all? Because I'm sure he, he, Chris watched that. He had to have. It was always on a Adult Swim's anime yeah. block. He you got know? lost looking for that, that dumb bitch in her fucking jewel shards, you know? Oh, okay. <laughs> he became a Sonichu. <laughs> Fuck. I'm done as hell. Oh, I like the <laughs> formatting here. This ended up being a Sonichu and Rose Chu play, not because of segregation, but due to the volunteers who signed up for the auditions being literally 85% local Sonichu and Rose Chu. This would become the very first stage performance of all of an all Sonichu and Rose Chu cast ever. A landmark and massive undertaking. I'm ready, Asterix. This is going to be not awesome. Not because of segregation, as if there are, like, comments people have had that this is segregation. Does that exist in the Sonichu world? Rosa Parks did a lot for the Sonichu people, <laughs> Asterix. The Sonichus and Rose Chus <laughs> would not fucking be where they're at if it was not for the Civil Rights Movement. The Jim Crow Sonichu was. God damn it. Asterix, it was a fucking hellscape. <laughs> Before Chris created Sonic G. Did you know? Did you know, Asterix, that Pokemon had to drink from a separate water fountain? Isn't that fucked oh, up? Fuck. That's fucked That's up. That's terrible. What kind of fucking society? I'm glad Chris solved this. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Bessie said Rosa Park Chew. <laughs> 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 Fucking head hurts. Oh shit! Oh man, Chris is looking, looking really bad. Jesus Christ, a Christmas play by Read by me, Mrs. Jesus Prime. Christ. August two thousand five. Chris. Christine. Yeah, Christine. I'm gonna die. Christine. Visions Christ. confirmed about I as Jesus Christ as Nazareth reincarnated and Magic Change signed you prime shortly after had taken Angelica Rose you back in time to. This is exactly <laughs> all it's going to be, Asterix. 15 really? minutes of this garbage. Now, there's occasionally oh. like images drawn that are shown here, but they're all made with like shitty ballpoint pens. Nothing really of note. Oh so why? God. I don't. I don't get this here. The backgrounds and everything, and some of the effects being blue, I understand. But why not have the speech bubbles be black along with the text? Furthermore, we can mm -hmm. see where he was correcting gold, and you can see black in there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't get so it. I make a <clears throat> but I don't think it's worth sitting through the whole fifteen minutes. Maybe when we get closer to Christmas, maybe. I was gonna say we can always uh, splice it or even watch part two. You know. Yeah, that's always an opportunity. We can have. <clears throat> We can have everybody in chat sit around the fire with us and listen to Chris talk about, you know, the the oh Christmases and shit from yesteryear. I want to put a fireplace in, in like, in, in the studio. Honest to God. I mean, we can that just put it so on the TV. We'll, we'll just put it on the TV like we always yeah. do. It's just, yeah. <laughs> I find a YouTube yeah. video of just fireplace <laughs> and loops and just put it on the TV. It's beautiful. We just, like, set a fire to the carpet in here. <laughs> that would be cool. We're going to light you on fire and you're going to die from inhaling the smoke of your own body in that like, booth. Yeah! I just yeah, exactly. <laughs> so let me see what we got oh. here. Uh, how about a palate cleanser? How about do you want to wash the crazy out of your mouth with uh, a little more crazy? Sure, I love that personally. Cool. Uh, I got two Terry videos. Of course, these are new because uh, Dare Dairy Terry met a uh, train <laughs> once, and uh, I don't oh. think he ever recovered from it. So let's take a little look here. Astrid, do you see my screen still? I see the your screen and our Lord and Savior. Good. So TV is now on for the viewers. Let's take a little peek. I want you to explain this to me, Asterix. Do your best. Okay. Christ is sacred. Linux <clears throat> is secular. Go shit on Linux. I don't care. Yeah. Um, yeah. Fuck Linux. I hate Tux the Penguin. Is sacred. Oh, God. Hello? Oh, no. Are you sure? No. What could go wrong? Oh, fuck. Hello? Yeah. <clears throat> Hi. Hi. Um, it's like oh. uh, Internet Explorer. Why do you, what do you use Internet Explorer for on Windows? Porn. <laughs> Lots. <laughs> I know, but do you know the joke? What do you use Internet Explorer for? Installing Firefox. 
Oh. No, no, listen. Are you are you listening to me? Are you listening to me? I'm not. I'm sorry. Oh. There's a joke. Okay. What do you use oh. Internet Explorer for? Okay. What what is it? No, to download Firefox. <laughs> I knew oh. it. <laughs> you heard that joke? You, you never heard oh, the that's joke? Funny. You know, it's <clears throat> I like to think that maybe he was setting up flyers around town with jokes mm -hmm. and people would have to call his number to get the punchline. <laughs> oh my God. I fucking bet. people. If, if people had to call him, they should have <laughs> asked him like they should have asked him what the, the punchline of the joke was and see if he could get it. See if he'll just start giving him jokes <laughs> like dad jokes. You, listen, listen, listen. You use Internet mm -hmm. Explorer to download Firefox. That's yes. the joke. Oh, I see. I see. I well, see. Do you listen? Are you listening to me? There's a joke. No. They they use it. <laughs> Man, this joke is really hard for this guy to get. Internet Explorer. To are Are you listening to me? Oh, are you listening to me? Are you no. listening to me? No. I'm sorry. What you use Internet Explorer for is to download Firefox. Oh uh, wait, I don't get it. That's a joke. Isn't One more time. Well, it's not funny. <laughs> One more time. <laughs> joke. Okay, now we understand. Goodbye. Well, that was a nice, pleasant conversation. That's wonderful. Yeah, I bet, I I bet you were thinking it was going to be the other one where he calls him a certain I word. I was. <laughs> I was very scared. You're a neighbor. You're a fucking neighbor. <laughs> You're a neighbor. A neighbor. Someone wanted to know <laughs> what I use Ubuntu for. I use it to download Ubuntu. VMware to run Temple OS. What do you use Internet Explorer for? Use Internet Explorer to download Firefox. Well, I never I understood. It. He never... He always talked about how much he didn't like Linux, but yet he would mm -hmm. use Linux as his, one of his primary operating systems while working on Temple OS. Why not just use mm -hmm. Windows? Is it because Linux is free? He couldn't find a torrent <clears throat> of Windows anywhere? Why was he using something he hated so fucking much? I mean, there's better distros I, of Linux. You don't have to use Ubuntu. <clears throat> Fucker. You've got me. I don't know. Sucker. I, well, I mean, there's Linux distros for, uh, like, Jesus and shit. There's Christian Linux distros. There was a there was a Linux distro for Jewish people. Really? Yeah, it was called Ubuntu. I'm not even joking. I am not even joking. <laughs> was Ubuntu. it really? Yes, that's dead serious. That's incredibly funny. It was hilarious. <laughs> I told you about. It was uh, even, like, I, I told you about uh, Linux for uh, Linux for African Americans on an old stream. Oh right? man, don't repeat it. <laughs> oh yeah. If you guys want to know remember, about but... <laughs> that, look up the GNAA on Google. Oh fuck me. <laughs> <laughs> they made a really interesting Linux distribution that was very, very, very useful. I remember now. <laughs> but we'll have a little peek here. Uh, we'll see if this gets the stream taken down or not. If it does, I'll just I'll, I'll chop this segment out after the stream's done. But uh, he How far sings. In are we? Uh, I don't know, halfway or something. Fifty-five minutes. Okay, oh, there yeah. you go. So here <clears throat> is Terry singing "Paranoid" by Black Sabbath. I love this video. Look at him go. Yeah, this is this is a good one. His parents are in the living room, like pass the fuck out. Watching Frasier. Yeah, they're watching Frasier. <laughs> Frasier. <laughs> Get it. Yeah. Come on, good man. Look at that shit. What a fucking beast. This is incredible, Astrid. I'm changing the person. I love him. I miss Terry so much, and mm -hmm. I didn't even know the fucking guy. Son of a bitch. And we've got other <laughs> shit to look at, but that was more of a palate cleanser, just these two Terry videos here. And we got a few I minutes feel before... Yeah, I feel a lot better too, mm -hmm. Astrid. Mm -hmm. we got a few minutes before I got to read Super, so let me look at something short, and then we'll read some Supers, and then we'll get back to other shit. We've got some Daniel to look at, and of course we've got some Cobra. But mm -hmm. let's see. Mm -hmm. uh, I've got some older videos that people sent us uh, <laughs> we can look okay. at. Yeah. Uh, these are some good ones. They involve shit, so you know you're going to laugh, Astrid. Oh, of course. I love laughing so at the, shit. These are great. So we have mm -hmm. friend poops his pants while trying to be funny, and then we have another one. It's a man who has uh, who has to poop panics at locked door. Oh, so fucking th these God. Are, these are good. I, I forget who sent <clears throat> these, but they came over Patreon. 
So. Oh, yeah. Well, thank you, Patreon. Yeah, thank you for paying money. Uh, <clears throat> I, I'm sorry, I forget your name, but thank you for paying money so that way you can uh, tell me to look at uh, videos of somebody having to poop. <laughs> what is this video right here? Bobby shits himself. <laughs> what? Bobby shits himself? Where? On on the friend puts his pants video on the that, bottom. It's just uh, a clip right. of 22 seconds, a clip of King <laughs> of the Hill, and Bobby shits on himself. <laughs> oh, I see. Yeah. That's yeah, a classic. So TV screen is on here. Let's take a little peek, Asterix. This is an old one, but a good one. Mm -hmm. uh, you, know. you can tell this guy's cool. Oh, oh, oh my god. I think it's shit. Oh my god, you told me. <laughs> guy, he shit right in her face, Asterix. Oh <laughs> right my in god, her face. I think she shit totally oh my god, you told me to poo your oh. pants. That is fucking disgusting. You just pooed your pants. Yeah. Yeah. Why would he? You know he felt that percolating. Oh yeah. yeah. He gambled. And he oh, lost. It, oh, it's like a balloon getting deflated. <laughs> show. I respect. Look what Show uh -huh. said. Uh, quote: "I'd love to taste it." <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> Good fucking lord. Guys. And here's another one involving feces. Only 20 seconds, but we've all been here. This is hilarious. Oh goddamn! Me at work five minutes after clocking in. <laughs> 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 I don't know. Oh, no. oh, oh. <laughs> His finger is opening. It's crowning. He's crowning. Oh, no. <laughs> I can get over oh, it. Baby. Oh, fuck. <laughs> he straightens out. <laughs> oh, he's gonna brown. He's about to How explode. How many times have you been there, Rogue? How many oh, times? Oh, my fucking God. <laughs> <laughs> More times than I can count. We've all been there. Jesus. Good Lord. Fucking Christ. Yeah, Dr. Alto Clef said he's shitting. Ooh. <laughs> but I digress. Oh. Uh, anyways, I need to read some supers, and then we will get on to Daniel and then Cobra and whatever else. So let me see uh... here. I haven't got anything from Depreston. Depreston? Uh, let, me, let me make sure he didn't send something before... Oh, we have a doc. We also have a doc to look at from him. By the way, Asher, we got to look at it this week. He made us a green text, green text? doc. Yes, he did. Ooh, it's been a while. Yeah, Hell so yeah. I'm I'm gonna pass it along to you after stream. Just remind me in case I forget. So yeah, let me yeah. get the music playing, and we'll get back. Ooh, there we go. You ready, Asterix? I'm so ready. Yeah. All right. Where was I? Um, 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 um there we go. And of course, guys, we have an art goal if we can hit it tonight. If we hit $400, mm -hmm. we will do an art goal. We are currently at $188.26. If we can hit it, we will do it. You guys can vote for it. You guys know the deal. Asterix, if you see any good suggestions in chat, please screenshot them. I've seen a few. I, I have gotten a few, but I'm also really leaning towards the Chris with all the golden girls. That would be funny. That would be oh, fucking fuck. hysterical. I'm going to go ahead and start the process of making the poll, and maybe we can have people vote art goal mm -hmm. let's do a 400 uh what was it uh chris x golden girls girls xxx there's one mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and then we will add more as we see them art goal review rogue versus review bra boxing but rogue gets knocked the fuck out would you draw that what was it rogue versus review uh, bra in a boxing match but i lose That'd be funny. I, I'm just, I'm, I, I would do it, but I'm just thinking back to how much I struggled with the last. Well, this is the second Arkle involving you in a, in a, in a ring. That's true. I'll, that is I'll true. do it. I cool. might need more time, but I'll do it. That's cool. So, mm -hmm. Rogue fucking, getting beaten up by Review Bra. <laughs> I saw Traffic Cone said Rogue telling Asterix that he's going to brown. Rogue telling Asterix he's. <sighs> gonna brown <laughs> yeah that'll just come off as a fetish thing and we can have one yeah, more for them mind, to mind, no 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 we're gonna do it and then we're no! gonna have a, a fourth option if they can vote for okay. so let me read some if you see it just stop me uh wolf okay. sent in five dollars saying was gone on a trip back with a joke what do you guys call a gay dinosaur a major sore asses nah, I, I can do one do you one better try calling it a mega sore ass rolls off the tongue well, that's a good one and welcome back Dr. Negus B. Wilden sent in $5 saying, I'm thinking of doing a Cobes Fallout 4 run. What faction should I go with? Ooh, who's the most god? Mm. Uh, some kind of raider group. I would suggest maybe 
doing Nuka World and then siding with one of the raider groups and then going back to the Commonwealth and taking over settlements as that raider group. Because um, that'd be pretty goth. There's a couple that have already come out that I like. Um, uh, do you? Would you be okay with me drawing Rogue naked? I don't give a shit. They're asking for the uh, the naked rogue with double barrel shotgun on Halloween. With what shotgun? Oh, opening, opening. Double oh yeah, yeah. Rogue. Uh, yeah, opening. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Door. <laughs> Halloween. Naked. Can we get rid of the third one and instead put? Because someone asked, uh, King Kazma asked for like a Barbie and Ken thing. It's topical. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. I haven't done a, a so, so rogue and asterisk thing I will, in a while. I will, I will uh, just do um, RNA Barbie Ken. Rogue and. Wrong and Ashok Barbie Ken thing. There you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's cute. It, yeah. Yeah, if we can hit it, there you go. Mm. Back to reading. We know what's going to win. <laughs> Reap and No sent in $2 saying, Hee ho, my grimmas. Well, hee ho to you. JC sent in one ninety nine saying, Do you think, uh, do you know where a Mike Hum went? Well, listen, uh, do we have any uh, Mike Hums in the chat? Has anybody seen Mike Hum? Mike Hum, where are you? Oh, you got me, JC. Oh, God. Uh, how am I ever going to recover? Polbun sent in 199 saying, You wonder what uh, white supreme assist think of Cobes? Well, they think he is the pinnacle of the white race, I'm sure. Uh, Vapor Pony, and happy birthday, by the way, sent in $5 saying, Dear Rogue, Kuko is currently camping. <clears throat> camping. He'll be back next week. Also, I use a birthday wish to decrease your height by an inch. Oh, God damn it. Asterisk, I'm now six foot three. Uh, this is awful. Uh, bitch. Bitch. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Soul Tales sent in two dollars saying happy Saturday Goat Mom and Papa Rogue well thank you so much happy Saturday to you Vapor Pony Inc then sent in two more dollars happy birthday in case I didn't say it before saying if you think about it this is a rim job oh yes it is S Glass Pool sent in two dollars saying hi Bill well hello Liquid Snappy sent in 20 gifts that's most definitely what's up uh, One Cent Wonder sent in $10 saying, I like the part of the video where the guy said, it's McNutting time, and then he McNutted all over the place. Yeah, he did that with his face. Uh, Z30,000 sent in $2 saying, tell my BF I said hi. Boy! Well, the boyfriend of Z30,000, um, uh, Z30,000 says hi. So there you go. I hope that gets you all excited. Uh, Stranger Bob sent in four ninety nine saying, can't make it to the stream, but here's some shekels for you, my guy. Well, thank you so much, brother. Barack Obama, Barbar, bar, sent in $2 saying, this country's best autistic cool guy and goat duo. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Autistic <laughs> cool guy and goat. Asterisk, okay. they called me cool. Oh, oh wow, Asterisk, don't make, don't make me think of fucking cool guy. <laughs> Was I the one that showed you hey, cool guy years ago? No, fuck so you've no. Seen, okay. I, know, I knew about okay, cool guy good, before that. Good. Um, depressed in his ass, he's, he says he has videos for you. Um, oh, do you want him to yeah, send them straight to yeah, me yeah. or do you want... Yeah, let me send them to you. While I read yeah, some yeah, here. Yeah. Okay, depressed in this one, um the one you wanted us to look at, the, <laughs> the Achilles Argyles video, I we looked into it. And while the things he says are terrible, I see why you want us to look at it. And we are gonna <laughs> we are going to take care of that. Mm -hmm. So give me a second. And Strick, I'm just putting this here so I can quickly grab it. That one's gonna be safe enough. Uh okay. where are we at? Uh there you go. Uh Oh, this is going to be great. I already can tell, Asterix. Take a look at that one. Let me see. Huh. Yeah. Uh, and then we oh, got one more here. Oh, fucking God, no. A lot of cards tonight, right? <laughs> I, I right, can't sorry, look at the, uh, the Better Call Saul <laughs> one. As, uh, not Asterix, Depressin. How do I get you so confused? <laughs> so Depressin. Tonight. <laughs> I, I can't. Now, listen. I, I know the spoiler for that because I, I unfortunately have seen too many Better Call Saul clips, but I'm watching through it myself right now. And I don't want to spoil too many things for myself, even though it's a meme. After I finish it, then we'll look at it. I promise. I just don't want to ruin it. You know, I want some of the surprises to be there. God damn it. So, uh, Asterix, you go ahead and watch those. I'm going to read some supers. Bet. Bet, bet, bet. Where were we? King DDD became a member. That's awesome. I'm glad it's the real and actual King DDD. V sent in $2 saying, Asterix, go buy a mocha pot. I will let her know. I will get a little What snippet. the fuck is a mocha pot? It's M O K A. <laughs> what, what's a mocha pot? What's a, a mocha pot. A mocha pot. Mocha. Uh, okay, I'm going now. Nerby T Top sent in $20 saying, How do you find General Lee's treasure? Just follow the racist paces. Ain't no chocolate. <laughs> 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 
That's terrible. That's terrible. That's good. Uh, Rigzilla sent in two dollars saying, "Don't call anybody." Well, you know, it's it's weird to hear that and not have my eyes burn. Shire LA sent in ten gifts. That's most definitely what's up. VV Geese sent in uh, five dollars saying, "Back from vacation. I still miss my other half." So this stream will help with my depressed emotions. Lol. Art goal. Rogan Asterisk in the quick art style. That would be pretty fucking cool. Shire LA sent in five dollars saying, "Woo! Let's drink to this tonight." Oh yeah, we we should. I don't know what we're drinking to, but we're drinking. And I got my water for drinking. Nefman Jones sent in five dollars saying, "Been a minute. Winter season is upon us. I recommend a nice bowl of goulash to fight off the cold." Well, that is a good idea. I might have to make some goulash soon. Sturgis sent in four ninety nine saying, "Hello, rim jobs and artistic goat. Here's an awful joke for the stream. How do you stop a dog from barking in July?" You shoot him in shoe. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that will work. Um, you're not wrong. You uh, you get a little heart. Good job. SN Scoundrel sent in $5 saying, What do a Rubik's Cube and a penis have in common? The more you play with it, the harder it gets. God damn it, guys. You, you guys are going to get me tonight. I'm going to be laughing like a little girl. Nefman Jones sent in $5 saying, Been going through old streams. Showed the girlfriend the one where I tell the infamous Halloween ends handjob story. Got a good laugh out of that one. Hell yeah. <laughs> good shit, man. Ghostface sent in $5 saying, I'm drunk in a Walmart bathroom. Also, Chris Chan is a heretic and Earl Doobie is a predator. Earl Doobie is a predator. And people need to know that. Chris Chan might be a heretic, but why are you drunk in a Walmart bathroom? Ted Comet sent in $5 saying, Did either of you see the vid I made starring both you plus Smoke and Kiwi called The Return? I did not. Shire LA sent in one gift. Cool. King Cobra JFS's abused liver sent in one ninety nine saying, Sloppy Dementia Toppy. Oh my god. Ugh. Ted Comet sent in $5 saying, Hey Asterix, do you think that Chris uh, tried to get Barb to floss with the old sh short and curlies? By the way, can I commission with some more stills from you? I saw that. I, I read that and I, I had to say something. Wow. Go away. <laughs> <laughs> so I did it to no on the um, stills then. Uh, no, I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, I, I, think, I think it was the short and curlies. I think Ted Comet's onto something here. Oh, God. God damn. Moon Noon Oom sent in two dollars saying asterisk is a gilf goat I'd like to fart. Oh, a goat I'd like to fart. Well, I'll let her know that she's a gilf. Uh, Kobe O was sent in uh, one ninety nine saying our goal Chris uh, on the dating show with gilfs. Uh, see, that would be awesome. We need to get him on a dating show with some elderly women. What could go wrong? Silent Wyvern sent in two dollars saying God, awful lot of uh, white people in the chat. I know there's a lot of fucking white people. Isn't that isn't that terrible? Look at society. Ice Baby sent in one ninety nine saying, "You both know he had her face in MLP. <laughs> he had her face in MLP. ML, fuck, I can't talk. MLP plushes hard. Oh yeah, he buried those fucking screams and muffled them, muffled them right into a Rainbow Dash plush." Peter Millick sent in four ninety nine saying, "What do you think are the chances that law cows you talk about might see your videos? If they did, how do you think they'd respond?" I'm sure somebody I've talked about has had to have looked at one of the videos I made. And they might not like the fact that I talk about them in general, and they're probably not going to like the fact that I like to, to make little subtle jabs, but I hope they at least understand that it's more that somebody's going to do it, I'm going to do it, you know? That, that, that's the way I see it. Somebody's going to do it, I might as well be the one to do it, and I'm going to say goofy shit along the way. It's nothing serious, I'm just here to grift. Uh, where did I go? Destroyer of Shed sent in $5 saying, Our goal, Christian as a gladiator in the Coliseum fighting other lol cows. That would actually be a really cool poster. Silent Wyvern sent in $2 saying, one, two, three, if you love balls and or Flutter is a troll. Well, Flutter could be a troll, but balls are um pretty neat. At least so I'm told. So let's see some one, two, threes in the chat for questionable sexuality. Peter Millick sent in $4.99 saying, we already know that Chris is no stranger to mutilating his own body. Since he thinks he's Jesus, do you think he might try to get, get himself crucified? That would be pretty cool. I mean, I would not be against seeing it happen, but it also would be pretty horrific. Ian Dubois sent in $5 saying, Watching this as I pack for a honeymoon next week. Uh, might watch all the VODs on our long drive. Great stream as always, Rogue. Miss Moo too, I guess. Well, I'll be sure to pass on the love, and I hope you have a wonderful honeymoon. Wings of Twitchbot sent in $2 Canadian saying, Son, did you make Christine, <laughs> Christine Jesus Chew do it? Oh, oh, I see. Christine Jesus Chew did it because of Sonichu's influence. I see. His influence is just that powerful. Hashtag fucking innocent. Depressed and sent in 499 saying, do you think that Tara's uh, 
I'm sorry. Tara's husband is ever just like, honey, could you do the Timmy Turner voice tonight? I'd really appreciate it. Probably. I'm sure that probably turns him on. God. <laughs> That's fucking nasty, man. Uh, I remember uh, I went to a convention some years ago. Uh, there was a comic convention in my town, and she was there. And the line to see her was long. And it was all these... It looked like there might have been like some kind of like school or something that went to the convention. Like, like some kind of field trip to meet maybe characters or something. And it was just this line of kids who were very clearly like mentally handicapped. And uh, I mean, it's not bad about it, but it was just something that really struck with me. So now whenever I think of, of, of Tara Strong, I just think of the long line of, uh, of children who were drooling. But I, I better shut my mouth. I'm going to read a few more here. Melissa sent in 70 smackaroos in whatever currency that appears to be. Saying, hey there, I hope everyone's having a good time tonight. Finally got to catch it live after some time. Didn't feel like sleeping anyway, lapping my ass off. Well, hey, sleep is optional. Uh, Chase Miller sent in $2 and got COVID. Remember to chug some water. Night, well, I've got water right here for you. Give me a second. Nutty Buddy said the Terra Tard Conga line. <laughs> That's pretty good, I like that. Water. Couple more here. Uh, Anime Game 16 sent in 499 saying in the bagel voice. Ooh, I was just firing up Rogue at the dock for being a, a Jewish. Now, now, see, I wouldn't do that. I, I would never fire anybody for their ethnicity, but I would fire them for not agreeing with my opinions. Two more here. Wings of Twitch bots. Sent in $2 Canadian saying quick is like Adam, tempted by Barb's forbidden fruit. Don't call her pussy the forbidden fruit. That fucking nasty. And the Melisots came in with a hundred more smackaroos and, and that currency to the CZK, saying, hey, Rogue, hold down the A button to take money from this super chat while I'm holding down the A button, and I, I gotta take your word for it, I think it's working. Uh, Wings of Twitch bots also sent in one membership, which is very, very cool, and most definitely, what the fuck is up? Asterisk messaged me. Let me see. Uh, oh, I see. She's saying that there, one of the videos has a little boner in it. You gotta be careful with that. Um, let me let me see if I can get a hold of her. Hold on. I'm gonna I'm gonna get just wait. Hold on. I I'm gonna call her. Hold on. What's up? Vaginal crease. There we go. She'll she'll know. <laughs> she'll know. So she'll be here in a second. No, there she is. What? I had to get your attention. I'm still... I, I, I finished reading What's Super up? Chats. Yeah. Oh, oh, I mean, I'm I'm still screening, but... How I mean, many more? If, if, uh, I'm halfway through the Brony Wants More Violence in MLP video. I think it'll be safe. Okay. And if then it's MLP, the other there's one... probably no bad words. There, there, there's a lot of um, uh, clips from, like, Hasbro, like, the show itself. I don't know if uh, YouTube has flagged stuff like that before, but... Okay, maybe. Well, we'll see. Should I try calling yeah, Pro, then... guys? Oh. Yeah. Should I should I call Pro real quick? Would chat like that? One, two, three in the chat. Should if I should call Pro, I'll call Pro right now. He's not gonna know. He didn't. He didn't even wait. <laughs> I'll call. Well, I mean, not right now. If they want it, I'll see what he's doing. All right. Give me a second. Let me let me call him real quick. Let me see if he'll even pick up. Any bad words. Oh. Uh, I couldn't even leave a message. Damn. Hmm. His voicemail is full. <laughs> well, he's got two phone numbers here. Let me mm -hmm. let me try try calling him. Let me let me try calling him from a different one. Okay. Uh which one? Let's try this number. This is exciting. Hello, come on. Yeah. Hey, bro, I'm on stream and chat wanted me to call you. Do you have any kind words to say to people? Because they can hear you. I can, I'm at a fucking bar, but holy shit, dude. I just watched a fucking documentary about that fucking chick that was like fucking the dude and cut, and cut his fucking head off. It's fucking wild, oh. man. That's incredible. That's awesome. That, yeah. What's her name like? Uh, fucking uh, Noxia Business or whatever her fucking name was? Yeah. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. Dude, yeah, she's fucking nuts. Anyway, uh, why do people want you to fucking call me? I don't know. They they told they me to call you. you. They they miss you and they wanted me to call yeah. you and, and say bad words to you. 
You could have just fucking invited me to come on stage. <laughs> oh, I, I know. We're we're kind of booked right now, but I I figured we could give you a call, see how you're doing, just get a little check it. Pro should call into the show more often. You you could you could call the show. We've got a phone number set up. You could call in and call me bad words. Yeah, but, there's landline and everything. Yeah, we've got a number. We've got we've got an 800 number. We've got a toll free 800 number now, bro. 1-800. I'm dead serious. I'm dead serious. <laughs> we. We raised a super chat goal last stream. We made fifteen hundred dollars, and I've got an active eighteen hundred number up for about a month. Incredible. Yeah, so now people can call in, and I'm I'm gonna pass a number along to you, so you can call in at any time. It'll actually play onto the stream. Okay, I'll text it to you. Yeah, I will. Yeah, you should scream that. But pro, I'm gonna let you go. You enjoy your your <laughs> evening at the bar, and I hope all the naked men give you a good time. Hell yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> there we go. Well, that was a nice little call with Pro. Uncle Pro That's is doing wonderful. very good. Sounds like he's trying to get some penis. So yeah. Oh yeah. But Astrid, it's time <laughs> for me. It's time for me to look at some more videos. Are you ready? Very, very much. Very so. much so. So who yeah, can we look yeah. at next? I, I suppose we could go ahead and look at Daniel. Okay. So there's a few things going on in his life. Mm -hmm. Uh, let me pull these videos up and get everything in order. He's also really hopping between like different accounts and TikTok. It's 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 very fun trying to keep up with him. Yes, it's mm -hmm. very mm -hmm. very very interesting. But uh, so earlier today, for example, he was live streaming as he mm -hmm. does, and he the video he made is called Daniel Larson explains his October twenty twenty three update. Uh. He spent like 11 minutes not saying anything, just looking at the phone. And then eventually oh. he gets up, walks away, and then he starts talking. And while he's talking about all this stupid nonsense like he usually does, somebody mm -hmm. spots him. Surprise, surprise. But it's not a bad interaction. It's just interesting. I always find it interesting to see him interact with other humans, if you could call him he that. He some chapstick, some Burt's Bees, Oh, dude. yeah, yeah. Wait till chat sees him. TV is some on. Cold cream. So I, I put it to about 17 minutes because the guy shows up about 15 seconds after. He mm -hmm. would never do anything like that, and I know it. Mm -hmm. And then he goes... Let me let me make sure that we... It's Max, so I've got it as loud as it'll go. Completely silent. Daniel. Hi, I'm a big fan. Um, hi. Hi, how are you? Hi. Um, I'm good. Yeah? What you been up to lately? Um, just business. Yeah? <laughs> got it. Business. Business, Astrid. Business. What do you what do you think business is? Being scared at night <laughs> and like touching yourself in the corner. I mean, that's that is business. That's what the Shitting Vanderwalls the are, are paying him for, actually. <laughs> I I can't. I'll post on anything. I'll, yeah, I can't do any photos. Sorry, it's a uh, new management rule. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Sorry. I mean, we can like, uh, if there's any way we can make it happen, like I can give you a couple dollars. Like it's supposed to be, it's supposed to be like twenty dollars, but I guess I could mm -hmm. let it slide. What? Well, what the fuck is the point? Why would you let it slide? I thought he couldn't do it because of his job. Let it slide because he can't do it, and then also because he wants the money, and then also he doesn't need the money because he has management, obviously. Oh, oh okay, okay. Well, I, I, so I don't see, see twenty dollars being exchanged, Asterisk. All right. Oh I mean, my god. Do you have a Venmo that I can send you he talked to? himself into and then out of the fee. Oh, okay. <laughs> He's a really good salesman. Nope. Sorry. Oh man. I mean. But I, I can let it slide. Just just one time? Yeah. For the one time? Yeah. All right. Oh, Daniel. You want to put up a little pose? Like, Imagine little... meeting uh, a celebrity sure. and you walk up to them and ask for a picture and they ask for $20. Asterisk, people charge more for that in meet and greets. Oh, fuck. I mean, a meet and greet is one thing, but like... Asterisk, do you know, how, like much, fucking... do you know how much what? I paid to get that photo with fucking Roger Clark? Take a oh, guess. Fuck. Take a fucking guess how much I, I was charged. $75. $50. Eighty, and you could actually charge. They had th they had things there in case you didn't have anything for him to sign. You could buy things from to sign. They had fucking Red Dead bandanas, and they were fucking twenty dollars. Twenty dollars for a fucking bandana. Yeah, come exactly. With That's what the fuck I was saying. It's like shit. I'm bringing some in. It should be cheaper. What the fuck? Oh my god. Oh, my. I gotta tell you about my, about my ventures later, though. Oh, <laughs> I spent way, way more money. <laughs> It's just it, that's insane, man. A fucking photograph, that much money. Fuck you. That's bullshit. Oh, right. man. Uh, thank you. Andrew. Thank you. Awesome, bro. Give a awesome kiss. Awesome day, man. <laughs> awesome. Me too. <laughs> All right, thank you. 
my mic back. Sorry about that. Um, so I did, I did confront Bob about. And then he's just right back onto his schizo shit. <laughs> so he is actually currently convinced that Bob is in on the merch sales because on the subreddit, people have been posting videos of like AI voiced uh, people that are supposed to be him talking about selling merchandise and whatever else. And he's convinced that's him. Uh, mm -hmm. Bob has told him that it is, quote, Photoshop and AI. I don't know, really know where the Photoshop comes into play. But Daniel mm -hmm. says that because Bob's not famous, there is no AI voice model, which is most likely true. However, he's just hearing a voice model of an old man. He can't, he can't discern the voices. Yeah. Yeah. The phone calls. And, um, and he did, like I said, all he did was get angry at the fact say that I've known him for however long mm. and I mm -hmm. know for a fact he would never do it and then he ghosts me. And see, oh, and it's see. terrible. That's really all this was. I found the interaction there interesting. But mm -hmm. here is Daniel Larson curator put this together. Uh, he said here he's mad at Bob yet again and he's tired of being used as Okay. Alrighty. So, Hi. I'm skipping court tomorrow because oh, no. Bob is telling me how to use my fucking money, and now I have a warrant. Oh no! So what? Did, what did he say here? Now, unfortunately, uh, it's a little hard to see, so I'm going to zoom in here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Let's see. He says I'm thinking about committing arson this winter to be able to stay warm. Well, that, that'll uh, definitely keep you warm until law enforcement shows up. Bob needs to stop telling me what type of music I can do. It's my fucking career, and I will blow up Bob's house with fireworks if he tries to control me on my fucking music. Oh, that's fascinating. Let me turn that awful music off. Thank God. Lower. Columbia Records, LBI Entertainment, and the entire Vanderwall family is angry at the fact Bob has money for motel rooms and food, but doesn't have enough money for three months' rent, so everything could get situated with the engagement and albums and UK tour. That would be awesome if he could get a UK tour. What does he want here? Like, how much money does he, like, physically want? He, you know? uh, he wants, uh, I don't know, however much it takes to make the music. So, three months of rent... I mean, I, I don't really understand. Like, he's paying for motel rooms. Isn't that rent? Is, is, it, is it a problem that he's not paying for three months of it? I think it's a problem that he's not paying for an apartment. Fuck like, him. He's, he's paying, fucking apartment? I know, but that, that's, that's the thing, yeah. I, three like, months of rent, I mean, that's... That's a lot of money. What? It's not yeah. cheap. That's Fuck, what? man. Oh, fucking God. What is this music? Really good music. I give oh, up fuck. as well, Bob, and I will bring you down too because you had enough money to pay for six months' rent. Oh, okay. Well, he should have. And then what happens after that six months? You know? I don't you even believe. Street again. I don't even Sorry. believe that Bob will bail me out of jail all because I've been living on the fucking street and I and if I would have just gotten the three months' rent, none of this would none of this, like I said, would have ever gotten this bad. What is he talking about? What's so bad? I don't know, the fact that, like, his feet are falling off, you know? Mm hmm <sighs> Depressin's got a good point here. He says, in theory, we could make an AI model of, a uh, Daniel, and then have him admit to doing horrendous things, play it back to him, and ask him what he meant by that. <laughs> Bob might have cost oh. my entire contract with Columbia Records, so if I find out that's true and Ivan is stealing my money, I would sue Bob for everything he has. Bob needs to pay for my Denver warrant. Why are crazy people always so ready to threaten litigation when they hate cops and, and the law? I've never, obviously I've never understood that. I don't like, obviously it's because it, it, it affects everybody differently except for them. And they're always a victim. Mm -hmm. Clearly, you know, yeah. I, man. court is there to assist him. Mm hmm. Says, oh, fuck. Like I said before, it's going to come down to a point where I can't take it to take it to physically and mentally anymore, and it's at that point. So, like I said, we'll shut this down either way. I don't think he's done, Astrid. No, he's never. He's always done, and he's never done. He's Schrodinger's done. 
When I asked for you know? Bob to pay, yeah. When I asked for <laughs> Bob to pay for lunch, he gave me five hundred for food, and when I saved three hundred, he got angry, so I had to pull everything out of savings. Well, that makes sense. You know, you were saving him money somehow, and that made him mad. Hmm. I'm starting to feel like maybe, um, uh, maybe that's not the real Bob. Mm. And it says, oh, uh, have fun, Bob, real. because a lot worse things are going to happen to, uh, to, uh, to happen now unless we want dead. Tina Vanderwall has actually secretly building a case against me because I wasn't doing anything they were asking me to do. Well, I'm glad he, he fesses up about the fact that he doesn't know what the fuck he's doing. And he won't mm -hmm. do it. Apparently he's been in contact with the Vanderall since, uh, since she was on America's Got Talent. Yes. Good to know. Good to place the timeline. It's time everyone <laughs> grows up and takes responsibility for the situation we got ourselves in. That is true. That is true. Daniel. <laughs> Mr. President is speaking the fucking truth here. I could care less about food for a day and save three hundred dollars since Bob is clearly going through a lot, uh, going through thousands of month, a month rather. Spending it on what? What's that old fart buying? Porn? Oh, fucking Rugs? <laughs> food and motel rooms for Daniel, apparently. God. Fuck me, man. Jesus fucking Christ! I can't deal with this. <laughs> I will not be silenced. I'm tired of being used. The Vanderwalls are saying that Bob needs to pay for an apartment now so things can move faster because we will need to hire an investigator as well now. Okay. I, I'm, I'm glad that... Yeah, sure. No wonder everyone was leaking conversations. I was in contact with Issy Simpson as well because of AGT. Okay, so now, now we... is she like 14? Probably. Oh, fuck. He thinks she's cute, Asterix. Oh, goddamn. He thinks she's sweet. <laughs> Depressant said that he buys rogue super chats. Well, he should buy more. <laughs> Bob right. also is lying now about when what I spend the money on. Because he tells me what to spend it on, and when I save the money, he got upset and stopped giving me money. That's why I pulled everything out of savings, and I haven't made anything. Okay, uh, how, does, how does saving money cost you money? How does that work? <laughs> Oh man, I I just I just want to follow his stream of consciousness for like an hour. You know what I mean? Man, get this man a podcast. Mm -mm -mm. Nutty Buddy said that Issy Simpson was eight years old at the time of the America's Got Talent uh, audition. Oh God! So he goes even that low. Whoa. <sighs> Bob is a liar, and at this point, I'm concerned he's putting money towards the wrong things. Yeah, like hookers and blow. So, do you, like, there's no way Bob is still in the picture, right? Like, uh, actual Bob. Maybe, but I'm leaning towards this being a troll. But I could be wrong. Of course. Yeah. Bob needs to pay me right now. Right now, bitch. Now, right, right now. now. I just reported <laughs> Bob to the police. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, He's going to put an ad in the paper saying that Bob owes him money. Bob won't listen to me, so I guess I might have to rob a bank. As one does, I'm sure he'll get away I with hope it. He does. Nothing could possibly go wrong. He's not going to get caught in any way. He's not going to get shot. Not going to get hit with a die pack. Nothing like that. Mm -mm -mm. But then we have one more video of Daniel. It's very, very short. We actually have two to look at here. Okay. Uh, we have the short one here. I'm going to pull it up for our viewers now. There we go. Oh, it's still muted. Fuck. <laughs> Silly. Sorry for the miscommunication, but the phone mm -hmm. that Daniel McDougall has that he confiscated is the phone with the child pornography. Mm, that okay. was from the fan. That. Oh. Okay. Amendment. So he was he was viewing child pornography because a fan sent it to him, Astrid. It's not his. Oh. It's, it's not oh, it's not course. his fault. His fan sent it to him and then he saved it and then he looked at it and he looked at it and he looked at it and he looked at it. And he saved it and he kept it and he kept it. And he kept it and he pulled his mate and he kept it and he looked at it and he looked at it and he didn't mean to because the fan sent it, Asterix. It's the fan's fault, of course. Yeah, obviously. Fans. Guys, Jesus stop fuck. sending Daniel Larson child pornography. It's not he cool. He keeps saving it. <laughs> if you send him CP, he's going to save it and that's not fair to him. He's got temptations, guys. Good fucking. Yeah, that'll really stand up in court. Yeah, they were just they were just sending me child pornography. 
I shaved it, but <laughs> just for evidence. For, for Fucking proof, sick you know? bastard. Fuck off. Nasty. But we do have one more Daniel video to look at. It's not a new one. This is actually an older one. This is his Like Meltdown. That's so, a long boy, isn't it? Yeah, let me... It's about 10 minutes long. Oh, it's a 10 minutes. Gonna, yeah, we, we can kind of skip around if need be. So mm -hmm. this one, he's word saluding a lot. Uh, he's having just a really, really bad meltdown. And the main thing is he just wants to be part of the Vanderwall <laughs> team. And if he doesn't, uh, he might have a permanent solution to a temporary problem. I'm, I'm laughing at this video in the bottom right. It says Daniel Larson running from the tickle monster. <laughs> <laughs> and, he's, and he's all blurry. Yeah, he's, <laughs> he's going to get the tickles in his booty hole, Asterisk. Oh, God. <laughs> tickle, tickle. But, uh, God damn. TV screen is now on for the audience. And let's take a little peek. Hi, Daniel. Hello, this is Daniel Larson. My phone ended up This is a couple years old. Night. I think it's from 2021 as well. Yeah, this is an older video, yeah. but a very good one. Mm -hmm. When everything was going on, I was tossing the phone in the air and it ended up, um, the screen ended up going blank. Mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. it showed static so please if you get this message know that i'm currently trying you can contact me through here fortunately i will have to give video updates this okay this message okay. goes out to the vanderwall family please please pray for the vanderwall Preach. family They're current that's the thing he can't pronounce w's everything that has the vaguely w sound has an r sound <laughs> When he says request, it's re request. It's a question is question. Mm -hmm. It's great. Mm -hmm. I love it. In critical condition. <clears throat> this message goes out to the Vanderwall team. I am currently trying everything I could possibly try. Even though my phone broke, I have still gotten out the message. I will give more <laughs> updates. He's having a really hard time operating that phone asterisk. Do you think he's going to be able to keep his cool? Well, I mean, he was just tossing it up into the air over and over again, really hard. Yeah. As you know. I mean, I think he can do this, Rope. But unfortunately, I really do. I'm without a phone right now. And so I'm currently doing everything by laptop. But fortunately, it will not let so me. They're tossing the uh, fucking laptop right in the now, air pretty so soon. Only do as he should. Maybe he'll slam it into his fucking head. Videos. God. But please stay tuned. I will try to give updates and I'll try to get everything situated. Hello, this is Daniel Larson. This okay. is He's looking a little bit more distressed now. The state of emergency order to the Vanderwall team. Please make another video and post it on all social, all social media platforms. And mm -hmm. say, please Crap, pray I can't deal with this fucking guy. For the Vanderwall family. Please pray, pray for the Vanderwall family. Can we all stop and ask you, will you bow your head in prayer with me? <laughs> I guess I have right, to. Right. Dear Lord, for... Thou mm -hmm. who art in heaven, got... hallow be mm -hmm. thy name. Uh, mm -hmm. Thy will be done. Uh, protect uh, Tina Vanderwall and the rest of the Vanderwalls, and especially Grace, and make mm -hmm. sure Grace is primed and ready to receive Daniel's penis. Thank you. Uh, in the Lord's name, uh, Amit. Dabs, Raman. Dab, dabs, Raman. Um, all that shit. <laughs> Happy oh, birthday, Vapor Pony Ink comment. <laughs> happy Great birthday, condition. Vapor Pony Ink. Leave it there. I want pictures of the entire family. Please post now. Now. I hate Hello, him. this is Daniel. Uh, Templar is asking who are the Vanderwalls. The Vanderwalls are is the uh, the Vanderwall family. Um, there was a girl, Grace Vanderwall, young girl who uh, was a singer on America's Got Talent, and. Mm. Daniel here is a pedophile, and he is infatuated with her. Larson, please let me know if there's anything I could do to help. Also, why the Izzy Simpson thing is so please, bad, you know? Please yeah. ask the Vanderwall team what I need to do to help, and also to rank up in the company. Hello. Come on, start freaking out. Come on, let, let's skip just a little bit ahead where he starts to get a little bit more. Well, he changes his shirt. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> what? <laughs> just, I'm just... <laughs> And this didn't the please sound. Please continue. So now that he's changed his shirt, he's now way more deranged. So I've deduced that the color of his shirt drastically affects his mood. Guys, check out my YouTube now and please comment. Check out my YouTube now and please comment. He has moved his card to yellow. Uh oh. Response, I will take it all down. Code yellow, guys. Code yellow. First right now. Do it now or I... 
Uh, came and asked uh, smash or pass on Bob's smash, 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 hard smash. smash, smash, hard mm -hmm. smash. Smash, smash, smash. Suicide. Depressant said, I can't wait until Rogue dies and he and God have to review his life and they just stop every five minutes so Rogue can explain his actions. Yeah. Like, God. For me, it's going to be every 30 seconds. <laughs> like, like, God, I didn't mean to kill that dog. I didn't mean, I didn't mean to laugh at that person on the internet. I didn't mean to call him dumb and gay. I didn't mean to make that person cry. I didn't mean to hurt that person's feelings. I didn't mean to dox those people. I didn't mean to kill that dog. That one I did, but that one, I, that one, no, that that one was an accident. And then God's gonna send me to hell, Asterix. That's pretty cool. God's gonna whip out a ruler and measure my penis. <laughs> he's gonna put you in hell. He's gonna see. He's gonna see and be like, oh, "You're not circumcised." Now I'm going right to hell. To kill me. <laughs> to do what? what the fuck? Please let me back on the team. God is like, what the fuck? He gets up from his seat. Just hold on. Let me get the magnifying glass. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> Turtleneck. That's my work. I'm sorry. Fuck. Oh, fuck. All right, you're going to hell. <laughs> can't take it. I'm gonna go cook with Kobe. Oh I hell yeah! Can't take it. <laughs> Josh, Greg, Vanderwall family, please. I hope you're seeing this right now. Please. I can't take this. Maybe they should put him on the Vanderwall family asterisk. He looks upset. Oh yeah, he looks like he fit right in. I'm worried for him. Suicide. Emergency. Emergency. What's wrong? Josh, beep, beep, Jay, beep. Vanderwall family, please look at my latest YouTube. Please look at my latest YouTube. He's turning red. He's probably been hitting himself. Plus, he's been crying. Oh, fuck. But he's really going to be crying here in a moment. This is my only source of contact. And to know that right now that you actually get it. Mm. Message me. Mm. Message me now. Fuck it off. If you guys start messaging me on YouTube so I know what the fuck is going on and I know I'm being hurt. He does look like a cartoon witch. I will start he taking does. the videos down. Jesus but fucking until Christ. then, I want to make sure that they get hurt by you guys. Guys, message me now. On <laughs> I love this. There's, we don't know what's going on. We have no context. Mm -hmm. But we have to sit here on and just worry. Now. 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 I'm starting now. to get fucking angry. Green. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. Me in big trouble because he forced me to do this. He's, he's... He looks like a spirit of Halloween decoration. <laughs> he's going to cackle at me and then cover the, the bull with his hand real fast. So yeah. It scares me when I try to yeah. go for a like, oh, God. Fucking <laughs> ah, Daniel. <laughs> if you guys let me join the team now. I will sit here and I Why is Chad fight. talking about Sniper Wolf? videos on Likey for uh, the rest of the night. Whore. To spread the message. I think we had like a someone pretending to be her and like oh. just making stupid comments in, in oh. chat. Yeah, but you have to. You we'll find that person and I will murder them, Asterix. Oh, fuck. Like that is an <laughs> actionable threat. To God. <laughs> yeah. God's gonna ask me why I was making actionable threats on YouTube. To fight. I'm fighting. That'll high five you. <laughs> now, guys, it's an emergency. Now, guys. And uh, Peter, I see you're a super. That's happened before. I will not take the videos down until I get on the team fully. I will not back down. This is my only source of contact right now. And by you guys commenting on my he's YouTube really that videos, deep. that's he's the really only that way right, right yeah. now. I know that you well, Let's guys skip a little right bit more ahead. He's... Mm -hmm. Oh, fuck. Here we go. <sighs> Turn to a tomato. <sighs> I demand being on the manual team. I demand. I demand I repent. Jesus I repent. fucking Christ. Shade Milkman, there is only one answer. Hit her with a brick. I repent. <laughs> over and 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 over. Until she stops God, moving. God, please. Look at my last YouTube video, guys. Now getting worse and i'm about to have a panic attack what do you think sab do you think anything is happening on his computer right now <laughs> fucking no <laughs> not for the vanderbilt i think grace vanderbilt personally called him turned on her camera gave him the middle finger yeah grace called yeah. him the n-word 
I don't know what's going on. No one is messaging me. I don't know what's being said. Can I at least mm -hmm. get some flippin' updates so I A can start attack, taking bro. some videos down? <laughs> what happened to my support? What happened to my team? What happened to everybody? Enstrick, is it bad that I kind of get satisfaction when I see this disgusting fuck cry? No, I enjoy it too. Yeah. There's some people where it feels good to be morally right for hating them. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. There Everyone. it goes, into his nose. Uh, no, I'm like, I hope it pronounced your name right. It has it exactly right. They said, I feel like, uh, I feel like absolutely nothing is happening, and he's just spirally entirely on his own. Yeah, he's, nothing's happening, you know? All that's, all that's <laughs> happening, really, is that he's locked out of the accounts, and he can't get the authentication number, or, or at least that's what I've gathered. So... I mean, if you don't log in, you don't log in. That That's just the end of it. Nothing's actively happening. There's not a mass shooting happening downstairs. On the entire team and everyone who is seeing this, message Josh now. The old and, Lubis, too. He's not on any drugs. Yeah, he, he's not on any drugs. Um, he has smoked weed before. Uh, we've got video proof of that, and uh, he's drank a bit. But uh, he's not a long-term drug user, uh, no crack, meth, nothing, which is shocking. You'd think he would be. He's just genuinely fucking crazy. He is nuts. The only reason why I'm And according to this Shane Milkman, um, to Sniper has the brick. <laughs> Good oh. luck, idiot. Oh, damn. <laughs> I want on the team oh. now. Do not block yeah. me on all social media. Maybe his I worldview is really cool because he always seems like he's tweaking. Maybe in his own mind, he is always high. Maybe that's how he sees the world, Asterisk. Ooh. That's why he gets terrified because he probably hallucinates. Like he might have more like more than likely. Because uh, I'm sure he gets auditory hallucinations, but we've we've never really talked about maybe him getting a like visual hallucinations. Maybe like that hmm. is a thing. Mm hmm. That he's just always high, you know, or mentally high. Maybe that's why the world's really so fucking die. confusing to him. <laughs> oh here we go I, I, this is the best part about this video oh, he goes go. from normal to angry to annoyed to angry to sad to angry I'm currently under attack please 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 I'm currently Hold under is new to this. Um, you Daniel Larson how, do you, how, do you, how would you describe him in like a few words uh, Paul Bun, Daniel know? Larson is a homeless, schizophrenic pedophile that has been stalking various girls online for years has been sharing questionable material, has claimed to have had child pornography, makes bomb threats, uh, often will mm -hmm. sleep in bathrooms only to get kicked out, uh, will dine and dash constantly for food. Uh, he hangs out with this old guy that's basically like a, quote, mentor to him. Uh, he would mm -hmm. just use him for money and then beat the shit out of him. Uh, he'll show up in random places, have meltdowns, call people the gamer word, or a series mm -hmm. of gamer words. Uh, just a complete fucking mess. He's just a homeless schizo pedophile, really. He's also a successful mu musician, and you should uh, stream yes. uh, Roaring, Roaring Thunder, Thunder on uh, Pandora and... Radio, iHeartRadio, Spotify, YouTube Music, all that shit. Well, be sure to stream something more and uh, Merry Go mm -hmm. Round, of course. Yeah, yeah, but he yeah, makes yeah. terrible music, and uh, he's just a weird rabbit hole. He, we've only really gotten into him the last few months. Yeah. <laughs> So as he's been on the, the, the recommended list for a very long time. Free and I feel silly. Yeah. Yeah. I'm a silly, silly bitch. I will take down two videos on YouTube to show Two videos. I, I will take down two. And it's not letting me into my email. He's going through the entire process of grief right now, you know? Yeah, all the stages. Now he's bargaining. I don't have my phone number. It's not sending a verification to my phone. This is my only source of communication right now. For email, it wants my phone number for verification. Please, all I need is an answer. Yes, you're on the team, and then everything will get taken down. Lucasm says, is it normal for homeless people to have a smartphone and, and good internet good enough for streaming? Actually, yes. You'd be shocked how many homeless people have cell phones. It's actually yeah. extremely common. Most homeless people will have a phone before they have anything else. I'm mm -hmm. trying to call Josh, but it won't be. At least in the U.S. Because I have to go all the way to the store just to do it. Having a phone is easy, too, compared mm -hmm. to everything else. Nice! Right, here we go. Yeah! Bang, do it bang, again. Bang. Let's do that again. One more time. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come come on. Do, do it in it. your nose. Harder. Right on your nose. Hard. Do it in your nose. Yeah! <laughs> One, two, three in the chat for Daniel hitting himself. <laughs> if you don't let me on the team now... <laughs> 
<laughs> I'm gonna have to die. I'm gonna have to stop. Oh fucking I'm god. Die. I'm trying everything. There goes Chad. <laughs> yeah. What the fuck? Was he gonna do both hands, go back and forth? I hope. hope he would alternate back and forth. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Damn. Damn it. I will take down all videos but one. I'm going to take down uh -huh. all videos but one on YouTube. But please, please fucking believe me. Please. That's another thing he does, Pole Bun. He uh, hits himself a lot. He's calling on the YouTube. So I fucking know you guys are. The anime games, we're not awful people. He's a filthy pedophile. He's got it coming. Fucking fact that I'm trying. How I want to. <laughs> it's depressing. What? I, 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 I want to be a oh. so I can so I can get a life. Ma'am, so there you go. You got a a view into his life, having a little meltdown mm -hmm. over not being able to get verification, which is something he's so anal about getting. Of but course. we have been going for about an hour and 47 minutes. We're probably going to go a little bit over the two hours range, I would imagine. Mm -hmm. So let's look at a little bit of Cobra. What do you say? Oh, fuck. We got to show him that one thing I found last night. Which one? The tactical Arby's. <laughs> oh, tactical Arby's. We will look at that after Cobra. Oh, yes, we have yes, to look yes, at yes, our, yes. our boy Cobra. So, of course, this mm -hmm. comes in uh, courtesy of Boglum Chronicles. Not a sponsor. If you're not subscribed to him, you should most definitely do that because that would be most definitely what the fuck is up, Tubes. Oh, wait, Roke, you pinned the wrong uh, message. I did? Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> Give me a second. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do either. I just pinned a different one. Sometimes when I'll click on messages <laughs> on my phone, yeah. Uh, yeah, it'll yeah. like click the one above it because the chat moves. Mm -hmm. Damn it. Fuck. It's I'm okay. embarrassed. It's okay. No, we'll find Astrid, something. This is, this chat is be the funny. Stream. Chat, say okay. something funny so I can pin it. <laughs> McNutt stream. Yeah, this out. is going to be the McNutt stream, <laughs> Asterisk. Anyways, let's look at our boggy boy. Yeah. Oh, fuck. Yeah, boy. He's looking extra he musky. Mm, I bet he stinks. Oh. Rosenrod, you think you're funny. Yeah. <laughs> So, oh, just God, take yeah. a note, he's going to look way worse a day or so later, and it's hysterical. <laughs> I'm glad he's got his wand in his, his front pocket on his jacket. That's great. They fucking snip. <laughs> <laughs> he comes his leg he, because he has to finish cheese. <laughs> God. That's another he thing, he's... So... I'm yeah. sorry. No, no, no. No, no, I just, he should be so happy that he has Super Chats back. Yeah, yeah, he's got his Supers back, you know, easy money. But he'll mm -hmm. lose them soon, he's gonna say bad words again. Thanks, YouTube, for allowing me to have Super Chat back, I really appreciate it. Oh, shit. That is true. <laughs> That's what I would Super... <laughs> He didn't like that. So here's two days later, still oh, wearing Jesus the same fuck. exact outfit. He has fallen asleep in that chair, undoubtedly both nights, drunk. YouTube, it's your boy King Cobra JFS. The wine's looking good. We're gonna filter that into a new bottle tomorrow. I'll but I can't do a Kermit impersonation. I'm sorry. It's, Kermit? I, I actually can't. No, you what, can. But what do I they can't. want Kermit to, to say? They just they just asked if I can do a Kermit impersonation. Oh. Delicious. Yeah. We'll filter them out into a new bottle tomorrow on the 18th. The best I can do is like Scooby Doo's laugh, but that's really it. Going live. Do the rehe. Uh, re uh, Come on. Uh, okay, re 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 re. Uh, I'm so embarrassed. Like the re. <laughs> like oh, that, that was terrible. <laughs> that's really out. bad. I I I I, I am practiced. I'm sorry. Yeah. Just click end stream. Re oh, and there you go. Start from there. It won't let you. So you got to close out the entire window. And manually close out the stream and end it from the control room. It's a pain in my ass. Okay. That's why I hate going live <laughs> anymore. It's because when it does crap like that, I got to restart the entire fucking stream. And it's just. So fucking what? What else are you going to do all day, buddy? Drink? Mm hmm. You can't drink. Your, your fucking half assed booze isn't ready yet. It's only, it's only <laughs> produced like half of a quarter of a fucking percent of alcohol, bud. There's nothing. There's like oh, an eighth God. there. Give up. Annoying as shit. We got a, do we have a video of him like drinking the meat at all yet? Uh, it's in this. Uh, okay, bye bye. It should be. 
even with my. I had a variety of videos put on the dock, but then I saw Boglum put Chronicles put this out, so it should be. Yes, threatening to uh, give him the the view, of course. Mm -hmm. Do shit to me on stream, and it, it, you know, I'm like, fuck them, they're losers. Like, you better not go live, Cobra, or I'll spam your chat with sicko shit and racist shit. And I'm like, so, I'll just delete your comment and block you from my channel. Why does he uh, care about racist crippled. shit? I I guess because it makes him look bad, you know? Like, people put bad shit in chats. You can clean it up, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. I don't know. I'm this this weird guy that, that thinks it's weird when white people get offended about other people saying racist shit. That's not even towards them. I don't know. But the, why, is he, <laughs> he's concerned for all the other races. He's, he's fucking concerned for, on their behalf. <laughs> Jesus, fuck. Um, German the Crippled um, said someone donate to sh uh, for him to shave his head. He won't do it. No. it it's it's not worth the money or, or the idea itself. You no, know? he's too pussy. Monetization yeah. back on my uh, super chats back. I mean, and the trolls are losing their shit. I mean, you're going to be making less money this way, dude. Yeah, I'll go live when I feel like it. But the only reason I hate going live is because the <clears> internet <throat> likes to freeze out on me. I really needs like a new internet box and everything. What's that? Of course. This is a pop tart sandwich. Oh wow. And if you know anything about Cobra, you can know his teeth are rotten and sensitive. Mm. It's that pop tart Skittles sandwich I made. Skittles? Yeah. Boy howdy. Oh. Now notice how he the way he bit that. He bit it with mm -hmm. the very back part of his teeth and then he broke it off from the back. Mm -hmm. It has to hurt worse from the front. You can tell he's moving the food around in his mouth really carefully. You can kind mm -hmm. of see mm -hmm. he's like pushing food around with his tongue. That shit hurts. Good fucking lord. Okay, so that was Skittles and what else on Pop-Tarts? He just said a Pop-Tart Skittles sandwich. Look like I he had beef jerky the on there. I'm going to say, yeah, beef jerky or bacon or some shit like that, you know? Something from McDonald's where it's just salt and sauce. You Max know? Power, I, I see your super. Someone has done that before. Mm hmm Getting the wine bottled up. Oh, goddamn. I've already bottled up the other two. Add two cups of sugar to that one. Uh, Destroyer says this is not sped up at all. Nope. He is on one, a lot of dust, I'm sure. Of water. Added water to both of them to top them off. So we're going to bottle up the uh, apple caramel cinnamon wine next. Oh, that is such a nasty combination. What the fuck? It's apple so... caramel cinnamon wine? That's it's like, like a... he's trying to make some kind of like novelty thing. You know what yeah. I mean? Like a fun, like oh. goofy, girly party drink. Next. Just get a bottle of like pumpkin pie, or I'm um, sorry, apple pie wine and get over yourself. It's so good. Try using this thing to do it. But that takes money, Astrid. I know, but and also that that is so thick and it's so gross. And like, I remember like I looked into like the whole like yeast thing he's got going on, and I I, I think the this video is going to touch on it. But he adds like way too much yeast, and it's not doing anything for his wine. Mm -hmm. It's not giving a higher alcohol content. It's just like making his wine yeastier, Ugh. which is fucking vile. Gross. Eh. I know. Can we put the insulin arc? I'm done as hell. Make a mess, bud. Come on. You know he's gonna make a mess. He's gotta. Oh, yeah. Oh, I want you to watch for chunks, Rogue. Just get a fucking funnel. He has a funnel and he won't use it for this. Look at the Stupid chunks. Stupid fuck. You can That's <laughs> my ass after Taco Bell. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> Um, well, there's not much of a mess, I don't think. I'm sure it's on the other side of the bottle, but like, look at it flow around in there. Like, like there's still rotten fruit. Yeah, that oh, needs flavor. Oh, buddy. Oh man. All oh, the caramels are dissolved in this one pretty much completely. Oh. Ooh. Uh, sugar. There's the funnel. Okay, he only uses that for the sugar. Right. You could just buy more funnels. 
<laughs> I know. <laughs> I didn't add two sugars of, uh, to the bacon one because it's uh, already I'm sweet enough. In the fucking hospital. Shouldn't you, at, at this point, like, if you're going to be adding fruits to the shit, don't you have to filter them out later? Like, you only need them for a, <clears throat> only a fraction of the brewing process? I'm pretty sure he doesn't need any more sugar, any more fruit in any fucking capacity right now. Mm -hmm. Like, I, okay, I've just been getting a lot of, like, YouTube shorts about, like, like meat and wine because I'm looking at Cobes' stuff. And, like, I think his problem is that he keeps, like, shaking it, like, thinking that it's activating the yeast, when in reality, it's just moving the dead yeast around in the alcohol, quote unquote. Mm -hmm. You know, he's not letting the sediment get to the bottom so it can be, like, like filtered out later. And should think about it, this, just... though. There's, there's not enough alcohol in there to really get him drunk, right? No, there's not. There's mm -hmm. not. So he thinks he's getting drunk. He's getting less mm -hmm. alcohol than he has in many years. He's also, people will send him sandwiches that are nothing but lettuce. Now, sure, they got condiments on them as well, mm -hmm. but they have lettuce. People have somehow convinced Cobes to drink less alcohol, so he's actually cutting back, and to eat mm -hmm. his vegetables. I, I would be okay with that if it was anything else besides lettuce. You know, that shit's just fucking water. I know, it's a vegetable then, asterisk. He's, he's growing. And even then, even then, all that is just salt, just more sodium, which is putting more strain on his kidneys, period. Because, you know, he's not fucking drinking water. His piss is dark brown. Ugh. It burns when he pees. No. Ooh. And I added the wrong measurement. I meant to add the cup to it, and I added the whole bag to it. Son of a bitch! <laughs> <laughs> Idiot. <laughs> how, how do you fucking accidentally do that? Just pay attention. Son of a bitch! Two cups worth of sugar in there, and you know I meant to add the cup, not the rest of the bag. He's so mad. <laughs> Darth Fruit basket, basket brings up a good point. Why? Uh, how has he not gotten a kidney stone? If he has, it's either still brewing in there, or he just doesn't talk about it. Does he when ever like, bring him. up like? No. Mm -hmm. If he if he had a kidney mm -hmm. stone, we would know. That mm -hmm. pain mm -hmm. is very particular. Mm -hmm. It's uh, not good. He would be. It would be great if it happened to him on stream. You know what I mean? Where he's just grabbing his his side or his back and he's screaming. Oh, when it happened God, to me, damn. man, it like it starts off. It starts by feeling like bad gas, and then it just yeah. gets worse and worse and worse, and it feels like somebody's just squeezing your fucking organs. It's awful. Oh, God. It's the closest Ooh. a man can get to, like, childbirth pain. I'm so sorry. Yeah, it's awful. The fork. Well, when it happens for him, it will be funny. Oh, he's trying to get the apple out now. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> I wish a lid would come off. Trying a shot of it. Oh, man. It's not ready, you fucking moron. Not even a shot. He's just putting his fucking mouth on it. Bacteria. There's so much bacteria in your it's mouth. Mm -hmm. Hey, there's Boglum Chronicles. That's most definitely what the hey. fuck is up. Welcome to the party, boy. Boy. <laughs> That's got a bite to it, folks. Couldn't go one incident without having an accident, could we? Maybe someday we'll be lucky, Astrid, and we'll get a Jenka mark. Oh God, I hope. I only hope. Way too much sugar in the goddamn That'll bottle. That'll be my dream, Rogue. Now I'm just making a fucking mess. God damn it! <laughs> <laughs> See, this is this is what's funny. It's funny when he gets mad at at, at his actions, not when the cops are called on him. Yeah, because he just does dumb shit, and when he realizes he does dumb shit, it's great. Yeah, exactly. I only added some sugar to that peanut butter bacon one to balance out the saltiness with a little bit of sweets. That's disgusting. That bacon's gonna be gross, rubbery, and chewy. Mm. Uh, Mutes is asking what jankum is. Uh, it's basically putting shitting in a jar, letting it sit in the heat or the sun, something like that, and it it just you, you get high off the fumes. Yeah. I it, it, jankum's my favorite party drug. So I'm trying a small oh. glass of that uh, apple caramel cinnamon mead. Oh my god! I'm gonna sample the flavors of my love. Uh, mm -hmm. He don't like he it. He don't like it. He doesn't like no, it. No, he don't like it. He don't like it.
That was a really disappointed look. Just caramel, cinnamon, mead. God, the snow. Just sample the flavors of my love. That's just very mm -hmm. disappointed. The the body language, everything. He was not happy about that. Mm -mm -mm. That was not yummy in the motherfucking tummy. But that's oh. okay. So, Exhumed Visions <laughs> is another channel that has uh, ties to Cobra of sorts. And mm -hmm. they put out a video about three years ago. We only just learned about it. It's funny. It kind of the same vein as Boglum, or not Boglum Chronicles, I'm sorry, uh, CEO of Cheerbugs. You'll mm -hmm. see what I mean. Uh, Asher and I were looking at this last night. So this is Tactical oh, Arby's, an experiment with Bond Tactical Soap. So this is going to be really Shit. cool. I'm excited. Fucking hilarious. Oh, yeah. Here we go. So TV screen is on. Let's take a little Recently, peek. I became a loyal customer of Bond Tactical Soap on the recommendation of King Cobra JFS. Okay. Now everybody knows that the soap can be used to enhance your alpha male status and make you more attractive to women. It's proven to revitalize barren wombs by boosting estrogen levels and making all <laughs> of age pussies wet. Yes. But the overall mission statement of Bond <laughs> advertises on a much larger scale than just its pussy wedding abilities, guaranteeing attraction, success, and fun. Mm -hmm. What happens in the most mundane day-to-day -day interactions with your average of-age female? What were to happen mm -hmm. if you had ordered food with pussy wedding pheromones emanating from your body, <laughs> walking through the air, uh. making lady nipples hard with a single whiff? Let's find out. <laughs> so, God damn. Here we have Not man nipples. Orders of Arby's roast no. beef. The back on the left there was ordered without bond tactical soap. The bag on the right. I gotta tell you, this guy, like, hit, there it is. This guy, like, caught my attention mostly because Cobra, like, linked to his, I think, his merch shop on his own, like, channel. Yeah. And he's like, check out this t shirt, fuck the trolls, that's what's up, stuff like that. And I'm like, oh, interesting. And I look into it and he is hilarious. He's got on his channel an eight hour long ghost box of Cobra content where it's just like over a thousand videos layered on top of each other. And the goal is just for you to listen to this hell noise and hear spirits. Yeah. It's amazing. I love him. Exune Visions, I love you. <laughs> I went home, lathered up, showered with Bond, went back, ordered the bag on the right. So uh, let's look at the difference here. Okay. So opening up the bag on the left, again, this was the sandwich ordered um, without the bond. <clears throat> so okay. it'll look pretty normal. It's a regular looking sandwich. No, um, no, not normal, Rogue. Them, not normal. I just ordered, basically what I said is like, I want a roast beef sandwich. Dry. Oh, First yeah, of course. Bacon. How could I forget? Dry. It's Arby's. It's dry. Sauce. It's just... Dried up Meat and bun. Nice bread. Yes. Bread. Put some bond on. Well, bag. let's see what's it's inside the other sandwich. <laughs> you can definitely tell the sandwich has some girth to it. Oh. It's a lot heavier. I bet it stinks. You know, it feels like three sandwiches. Oh. And did you get <gasps> that wet spot it left on the table? If you're on a date with a girl, <laughs> she gets up and leaves a wet spot like that. Oh, I'm you know excited. The Bond pheromone <gasps> is doing its fucking uh, But anyway. That is exactly what a wet pussy looks like. Back to the sandwich. Oh, goddamn. Look at how fucking <laughs> wet and moist this Oh, there we go. So, as you do with, with wet pussy uh, sandwiches, you have to dig around with your fingers. So, Chad, I want you to, to put an image in your head. This is basically a visual representation of what Chris was doing when he was stirring his mom's pussy. Oh, God. That look, it looks exactly oh, like man. it. That's the difference with tactical soap, Ripping, baby. Sopping wet. Look at that. Oh, fucking okay, God. Now, this is, <laughs> again, the sandwich that was ordered after using the bomb. That, exactly soap. like that. And there's absolutely Get your fingers no out of there. Denial. There you go. Start digging. <laughs> Start stirring. They, they work. Uh. <laughs> I went to Arby's, and look, no pheromone soap. Hey, give me a fucking roast beef sandwich. Eh? They gave me that shit put the bond on then they gave me the fucking wettest shit i've ever had in my life no holy bond. shit dried up piece of shit <laughs> look at that <laughs> fuck you <laughs> bond on uh, it's wet <laughs> oh, it's so juicy. oh yeah there we go now he's gonna tickle it he's gonna dig his fingers in there listen i shit you not i'm sitting in the drive-thru the girl who took oh my, my order god. 
<laughs> oh man. So really nice oh man. But I'm sitting there. Get your I finger can... out of there. Boy. <laughs> God, the dude's making my pussy wet. <laughs> like, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> the bomb fucking works. Yep. Oh, Just like my. Barb and Chris. 20 bars uh. of it. You'll get so much wet <laughs> pussy. It's not even funny. Buy, buy a bunch of it. I like how he's doing it underhanded. You can tell this isn't his first time fingering a sandwich. He's looking for that He's rubbing though. the walnut. Get pussy. Get wet pussy. Like Bond pheromone soap. This should be on, like, the page to buy Bond pheromone soap. I know. I oh, feel come like... On. Come on, Grundex soap. Come on. Come on. I feel like that would really just round it all out. But <laughs> shit, Asterix, we need to look at these videos from Depreston. Yes, Have yes, Have you we do. finished screening them? I didn't finish the brownie one. Okay, but... well the brownie one should be fine. But um, the the blue debity one. Yeah, we'll works save that for the outro. the outro. We will use yes, it for an yes, outro. Yes, yes. Uh, yes. Let me pull up some of the other videos we got from you here to Preston. Give me a moment, and that should be oh uh, yeah, that looks like all of them. We got four here, so we'll start mm -hmm. off strong. We'll look at this uh, video where it says uh oh god Achilles Argyle's video. It's a reupload. Wait. What? I didn't I didn't screen this one. Asterisk. You're supposed to look at it later. No. We, we, Are you sure? Asterisk, we talked about this off stream. We we know what's the deal with the video is. Okay. Okay. I just I mean he's not gonna okay. say the gamer word. So chat Okay. <laughs> I want you guys to feast your eyes upon this video. He's gonna make some strong arguments here. Now before you all grab your pitchforks and storm into the comments section over the title of the video alone, let me just say that of course racism is bad. I wouldn't make a 10 minute Jesus video defending Christ. something so obviously terrible. Generations have been ruined because of racism, mm -hmm. and lives are still getting destroyed by it. However, I don't- Okay, so now we know he's serious. He's gotta put his fucking <laughs> oh, feet down. I don't think we should yeah. be painting racism as entirely evil, because, well, there's a reason why people are racist. Wait a minute. And that's not because people want to be bad. Oh. It's because there are objective benefits to being racist. And I don't think oh we should my be God. discrediting these benefits with all this virtue signaling bullshit. Because uh -huh. we are seriously reaching a... I'm glad he emotes with his, his, his toes and shit. Low point in history Ew. without racism. A lot of people don't know this, but racism is actually the natural state for a lot of people. And has been for oh most of God. history. Somebody in chat is really agreeing with what he's got to say. By some <laughs> groups, people are able to be among. A wise fox asked, "Why are his feet so detailed?" Well, I don't know. <laughs> Let's skip ahead. Maybe you'll have something interesting to say. Need people. Oh, that's been Laden. Laden. Oh, okay. Let's skip a little further ahead. His feet are gone. By anyone his feet are gone. The what the fuck? Virus but then, the oh, oh, they're gonna come back. So they funnel food and water to them. Hello, children. Instead of the oh, oh they're back. And now oh, they're. Oh my god. They're sweaty and they're stinky. Men, women, and children oh my in their God. Own country. Asterisk, I love how he's got the same format here. Look, his desk, our desk. Ransona, <laughs> our sona. <laughs> Stink. Stink. Yeah. To, their own to figure it out for themselves. Similarly, Asterisk, that would be an art goal to, re to redraw Asterisk in this style, but with stinky feet. No. Syria's Fuck no. Somebody draw that. She won't no. do it, but somebody else can. No. Even no. To accommodate banned. Them. Banned. banned. The Simplar is asking, why did they change color? They're not changing colors. They're getting gassy. They're so let's skip a little further ahead. Statistics. Oh, okay. Yeah, what is wrong? People do have their own shortcomings, too. You know, I'm so starting to think maybe his feet stink. They've only ruined pizza and Italian carbonara. Maybe. Which weren't too good to begin with, so not much loss there. If you've stuck with me thus far, then I need you to... Oh, oh, oh now oh, they're gone. They're no stink. longer stinky. What I'm about to say may the sound anymore. bad. Well, the stinkiness is gone. That's basically the joke of the video. We're not going to sit through oh, 10 right. minutes of him explaining it all. But shit, we have another good video here. We have, mm. Brony wants more violence in My Little Pony. I wonder how well that's going to go for him. I hope to God it's okay. Greetings, and welcome to my latest video. This time, I'm going to play well. Let me turn him up just a smidget. There we go. Please don't say any bad Walk words. I'll be banned again. It, so that you can understand what I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. When we last left the ponies of Ponyville, the mm -hmm. Cutie Mod Crusaders had to deal with a bully named Bab Seed. And the entire what is up with you and pony bullying. stuff, Depreston? He thinks uh, bronies are hilarious. Oh Depreston's stuck in 2014. 
<laughs> I don't blame. So the, it was so a better time. The fact that I'm an adult, <laughs> a little sensitive to very, very specific situations that happen on a television or computer screen, I kept kept on expecting this episode to show some blood. Mm -hmm. Have hardcore being from Babs to one of the King Mark Crusaders actually kill one of them, or maybe frame so he wants his little horses to die. Aren't isn't the, ways. isn't My Little Pony like a children's show? It is. It is a children's friendship show. Now, if memory yes. serves, wasn't there a, an online series that was kind of cutesy that dying animals, happy tree friends? Wouldn't that scratch the same uh, itch? I guess. I mean, it's I been suppose. years since I've thought about it, but I'm sure that would scratch the same itch if he wants to watch cute characters get maimed. I don't think he wants to watch it, but I think he was expecting the worst outcome based on like consuming other media. Because for some reason, I'm sure he he mixed up a, like the tone of, of of My Little Pony with Family Guy. Oh my God, Dank and Derby Gamer brought up fucking retarded animal babies. I haven't thought about that in a long fucking time. I have no clue what that is. For murder, or theft, heck, maybe have a scene where Babs takes a knife. Almost because like one, this little horse child came up and started bullying the other horse children. All of them. MC's mouth for the yeah. purpose of putting a smile on her face. Mirroring the famous Why Show yeah. series scene from The Dark Knight. <laughs> Just to add no. all up, I was expecting Babs or the CMC to say something similar to what the angry video game nerd or the nostalgia critic. Astrid, I wish I could talk like that. That'd be so cool. Can you imagine me with a speech impediment like that, but I still do the voice for videos? I, w I wouldn't talk to you. <laughs> uh, would, that, would that really be a deal breaker? No, no, oh, I'm, I'm absolutely like upset over what they were reviewing. <laughs> it was for this reason that I prayed to God that I wouldn't curse, punch I it on my like computer lists, monitor, personally. get so up. Do they annoy you? A little bit. How many people bit. in chat here have, like, a uh, speech impediment or a lisp, something like that? Just know that I mean, Asterix hates you. Yeah, I hate your guts, but, like, also, I can't speak on it very much because I, I myself have speech impediments. So, I mean, it's, it's, I just, you know, But a really, really, course. really obvious ones annoy you, right? I'll, I'm like, all I can focus on is the. St 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 I'm like, stop. Uh, you know? Barbar, <laughs> use the use the two. Set of what happened in the episode, <laughs> or even hit myself or something like that, or you know, like that. See, let's see that. He just fucking starts cutting himself to, to demonstrate how it should have been. That is a bad thing for me to do. <laughs> And not like you said, I, I have the speech impediment called British accent. Leave! <laughs> in this episode. Babs just acted like someone who wanted to embarrass the cutie mark crusaders and not and these, give these them horses are like blood. five, I think. I talked to a like, friend. Probably. Like, the, like, I don't, I don't get where he's coming from, where he, he expects this other five-year-old horse to stab these, these kindergarten ponies. This guy's a member of a fandom that, like, sexualizes a children's show, so, I mean, him True. hoping for gore isn't too far out of the question. And who oh, said yeah. that it's a kid's show, and that I should learn not to expect stuff like that. Well, let me tell you something. This is like Mr. Like, Enter with a worst impediment. How am I supposed to oh, not God. expect hardcore violence or intensity in a kid's show when I know that there exists an anime movie that has this in it. Oh. That's not even the same thing. Yeah, that's no, not even yeah. the same thing at all. His head would explode if he watched Watership Down. Oh, God, yeah. Is that what it's called? Yeah. Oh, okay. I'm gonna skip ahead of that. I was like this during the camp lot wedding and a little bit of the Crystal Empire. In a Kent Lot Wayne, I was expecting Princess Celeste to give Twilight Sparkle a hardcore beating for warning her about Kane similar, similar to this. Oh yeah? <laughs> so he just wants there to be a lot of really hardcore violence against women, specifically. He's expecting it, you know? He must have grown in a really bad household where he just mm. automatically assumes the horses are going to hurt each other. I shouldn't talk bad about him though, because he's got a cane and a piano. You and see? a cuckoo clock. Oh, I and every love time someone clocks. says the word defeat in a show like this, I keep on thinking of death or kill or even lifeless bodies. I thought Celestia died when she lost. His glasses are crooked. They are, and they're also squeezing his little head. Yeah. Crystals. Everyone says the word what defeat. Weird in comparison. That Don Bluth movie to My Little Pony. How in the hell can you survive something like that? Even who survived too? 
because it's not it's fucking cartoon. real. They're horses. They're magical horses. Yeah, like they, they don't it's exist. It's not real. And the Crystal Empire, when Twilight encounters the Door of Fears, I was expecting Celestia to murder Twilight the way she was acting. I mean, does anyone on the retarded. crew or Ryan staff I mean, yeah. know about Freddy Krueger, a killer that goes after you in your dreams, and when he kills you in such a, a violent manner in your dream, you die in the real, real world? Real world. Why do we even have to have this <laughs> band expecting such hardcore, dark, and sadistic <laughs> material in a kid's show when it won't even remotely happen? I wonder what conversations well, he was on having on hand, Discord. I'm extremely oh hyped for the latest episode, Magic Duel, Fortune. with Trixie's return in it. Apparently, I really didn't want to spoil myself on reading some of the articles or stuff about the episode, but it is no doubt that Trixie is in this episode. Mm -hmm. With a tile like Magic Duel. And that's the, that's the horse he wants to have sex with. Duel, with oh, Trixie I see. Involved, this horse, as opposed to this horse, I see. some epic battle of butt-kicking. Mm-hmm. Heck, this episode's getting a little more publicity than the other episodes before it. USA Today just wrote an article about us bronies. Speaking right. of articles, here's a oh, little God. annotation linking you to an article about me and a man named James Swift wrote. If you're on a mobile device, which many I don't know of you what, what are, you, just you said. probably won't be able to see the annotation. James so you have to <laughs> click the link in the description to get back there. Mm -hmm. Get there, I mean. Back to Magic Duel. Do you think he's had sex? Like, after this video oh, was made? Because oh, we know oh, not before oh, this, but oh. after this, do you think he's had it? Oh my god, Rogue. No. For the episode, I'm going to have my Tristan <laughs> Russian pony figure on my desk. And if anyone can make... Asterisk, what we need to do is we need to we need to build a, like, a little dating show for a stream. Uh, let's get, mm -hmm. like, let's get five autistic girls and one incel. Oh god. And have oh, him meet god. the... Have him meet the slow girl of his dreams. Oh... One incel who hates the world getting paired up with an autistic girl that likes to draw. What could go wrong? <laughs> a piece of artwork to look like a movie poster for this episode, then do it. In the style of Drew Struzan, one of the greatest poster artists ever. I mean, he created the Star Wars and Indiana Jones posters. So, are any of you hyped for the episode? And can any of you provide an explanation for why I keep on expecting such hardcore dark I'm sorry, Kamen Rider Decade, no more Daniel. Yeah, 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 no more Danny for now. The shrewd shit's called Comment me the autistic girl who likes to draw. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. See ya. This is not wrong. Well, there you go. The person wanted us to see that. And then we have one more from him. A simple one. Okay. Saying, this is funny. <laughs> who remembers King Ass Ripper? Who remembers King Ass Ripper? My friend brought me to his attention when he talked about King Ass Ripper. I never really heard of him until my friend mentioned that. Then I looked it up. It's a guy farting. <laughs> <laughs> a guy farting. Well, yeah. Comments say. You got any good comments? I remember King Ass Ripper. <laughs> <laughs> King Ass Ripper did did do a little bit bit of farting. You are you are correct. Thank you. Thank you for sharing. There we go. I love That's the nice a good comment. smiley. Yeah. He needs to know he's supported. Why has he got a USB there? What do you, you think's know, on there? For all the King's Ass Ripper videos. I downloaded all the King Ass Whipple videos. Oh, God. He's just wanting a what? <laughs> it's like talking like a baby. In the other video, Depressed and Sent, we will use as an outro for the end of the stream. Oh. But shit. Exciting. Let me see. We have been going for about two hours and 20 minutes and 30 something seconds. I need to read Super so we can get the fuck out of here. But. Yeah, let me get the music playing again. Ah, there we go. So we are currently at uh, $293 out of the $400 art goal, so I don't know if we're going to hit that art goal tonight, but that is okay. No pressure at all. Let me read There's some supers here. Always next week. That is true, and mm -hmm. we'll be doing something vaguely Halloween-ish next week. Yeah, we will see. A little, a little bit, a little bit. Going out of, looking at some people we haven't looked at before. And some ones we have, you know. Digress. Anyways, where were we? Uh, where do we go? Wings of Twitchbot sent in one gift. That is fucking most definitely what's up. Melisauce became a member. Fuck yeah. I need a dick in me. Sent in one ninety nine. And who <laughs> looks worse at this point? Chris or Cobes? Um, Cobes. Cobes. 
Hobes is more with it. He just looks terrible. But Chris is just not with it and always looks terrible. Uh, let me see. Obi-Wan Kenobi sent in $10 saying, Goat Mother, please forgive me as I have transgressed against Lord Rogue. It has been four weeks since I last caught a live stream. Please give me penance. Ramen. Blessings upon you. Ah, there we go. <laughs> All is forgiven. <laughs> Ramen. <laughs> God fucking damn it. Where did it go? Aha, found it. Uh, Max Power <laughs> sent in $2 saying, Here's my hard-earned two doubloons. Little Knickers. Well, I'm glad you like the movie Little Nicky, too. I, that's a good-ass movie, and thank you for your doubloons. I'm glad you shared them. The Cat Warrior sent in $5 saying, came in to watch, and the first thing I hear is feces. Awesome. Well, that's how you know it's a good stream. Only the best streams talk about poopy and duty. Wings of Twitchbot sent in five gifts. That's fucking awesome. Once in Wonder sent in $5 saying, Art Goal, Ezra gets shot by paintballs at the paint a goat -a -thon at RogueCon. That be great oh, instead it's like a, a dunk tank but instead of throwing balls to dunk you in water they just shoot you with paintballs and you're stuck get a snippet of that for me pretty please you, you want that to save that one for yeah, later why not yeah that, that's yeah, a good yeah. one that's i like one. that one a lot lots of colors yeah and there you go asterisk in joy thank you cool uh where were we Wings of Twitchbot sent in, or we read that one, but HCNO sent in $5 saying, Did you know that when a short person waves at you, it's called a microwave? God damn, mm -hmm. <laughs> that's pretty good. Anita Dick and me sent in one ninety nine saying, If Naked Rogue wins, I want it as a sticker. Well, I don't think it's going to be getting anywhere, and it looks like Golden Girls x Christian, if something were to win, it would be that. Uh, voices in your headphones sent in $2 saying, Sorry, I don't send supers anymore. I'm broke laughing my ass off. Well, hey, buddy, it's all good. Life is what it is. No pressure at all. I'm just glad you're here to stop by. Travis Gardner sent in $5 saying, Is Goat Mom wearing a hoodie, jacket, or cardigan? And can we have an asterisk and a cardigan drinking hot cocoa for Christmas? Um, I planned it as a, uh, like a, like a jacket, like hoodie combo. Mm -hmm. Um, <clears throat> and I think I can do that. I mean, I, we can probably show it on stream for a minute, put it on the Patreon. I, I, I can doodle something. Yeah. Oh, there you go. Yeah. Um... We see Phyrexian Library sent in $10 saying, glad I caught you guys live for once. I'm laughing my ass off. Take my monies. Well, I can certainly do that for you. Rick Zilla sent in $2 saying, hey, Rogue, do you know what a Chicago sunroof is? Oh, yeah, it's defecating through a sunroof. I know all about oh. it. Holbutt sent in, it's really bad if you defecate <laughs> through a sunroof and there's children in the back because then you could be labeled a sex offender, Asterisk. Did you know that? That's... I did not know that, but I guess now I do. There was a there was a ruling on that. Just so you know. Okay. Yeah. Thanks. Yeah, I just thought I'd share that with you. Uh, pull button sent in one ninety nine saying make Rogue an old man with very low hanging nuts. Well, I mean that is an idea there. I like that. Just the saggy old man balls. Patio furniture sent in five dollars saying Confucius say all poo poo times are pee pee times, but not all pee pee times are poo poo times. That is true. I want to get that tattooed on my back, Asterisk. It's going to be awesome. <laughs> Seraph Lovelace sent in 199 saying, Please step on me, goat. Uh, Asterisk, you have to step on Seraph. Oh, okay. I mean, I, I guess this, this is my life now. Lubis said, Where have I heard that before? Where is that from? Oh, I don't, I don't know. I don't know what you're talking about at all. <laughs> and uh, the Devil's Advocate sent in $5 saying, Just got off work. What horrors await me on the stream, Shuckle Lord? Lots and lots of horrors, but I think you'll be able to stomach them. I see Club Doom in the chat. Would you like to come on stream at some point, Club Doom? I didn't get the chance to ask you in private. I've got you added on Discord and shit. But uh, we are looking to have people on. And, and before I forget, too, I've been talking to Smokey. Finally got him and Kiwi added on Discord as well. Gonna get everything ironed out. But Smokey said he will be available... Uh, on the 18th of next month, hopefully. So if all goes to plan, we should have him on next month, right smack in the middle. And Doom, I will, I will fucking link up with you later, probably tomorrow, if not the day after, and we will discuss the finer details. Uh, the Devil's Advocate, uh, Obi Wan Kenobi sent in five dollars, saying our goal: the passion <laughs> of the Christian movie poster. Movie posters <laughs> parodies are always great. <laughs> Fuck yeah, I need a dick in me. Sent in four ninety nine, saying, uh, "Where to go?" Hey, Asterix, is the purple stone on, around Chris's neck the new art uh, in the new art a dusk stone? Also, I liked the red and blue ghost sprite on the Poke Walker. Uh, I, I, I gave them a small snippet of his chest on the uh, Patreon. That's lovely. Mm -hmm. Um. Okay. So, 
uh i love that he, that he noticed uh, the red and blue ghost bright very cool and fun yeah um the purple stone is really just supposed to be like an amethyst he had some kind of like dog tags or something but i figured uh looting back to like his his power stone is much more fun yeah but i uh dusk stone is is, is just as equal a uh, a very cool thing to do and i should have done that there you go <laughs> and that was did Sonic you look like he was scared of the ghost or what the fuck ever yeah he's like help <laughs> uh, i had to have mel explain to me the the ghost shit uh, yeah, Why'd you, you ask you, me? you I, I don't know because uh, I was looking at it and getting the uh, uh, stuff posted on Patreon. She walked in and I was I asked her if this if the ghost is significant. I didn't realize you you have you can only see them with a certain thing. So now yeah, I know. Uh, yeah. 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 Cool. <laughs> uh, got a few more here. Tusky sent in five dollars and good evening, Rogan Gold Mom. Ham shackles. What's Whitney Houston's favorite type of coordination? <laughs> I, they, I'm not singing that. It's it's <laughs> hand eye. Yeah. Yeah. Hand -eye. And a good night, brothers. Stay safe. Well, there you go. Good. good shit. The world end with, ends with you. Sent in one ninety nine. Fuck yeah. Maxed power. Sent in two dollars. And here's hoping Pro gets his pooper scooped. Well, I'm sure he will. I, I hope I didn't ruin that for him. But he was screaming before he ended the call, so maybe that worked. I don't know how gay men and gay bars function, but I'm assuming that it just involves penises. Rick Zilla sent in five dollars. And you think this is bad? This chicanery? He's done worse. Oh yeah, I, I know. He's done way worse. Way worse. Can you believe? Can you believe he would have a battery in his in that fucking phone in his pocket? What chicanery? Astro, do you like that word chicanery? I don't I even like know what the word. fuck it means. I like chicanery. That's a fun word. That's a good name. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Ted Comet sent in two dollars saying abracadabra, abracadu, Mrs. Moo can't say millennium. Millennium? Yeah. You can't say oh. millennium. You <laughs> yeah, you're right, I can't say it. <laughs> yes. Uh, Peter Millick sent in four ninety nine saying, "Rogue, Gino is doing a, a stream right now, and Chris is commenting on it, or at least as someone who has access to Chris's channel. Yeah, he's done that before. He'll pop in on Gino's streams. He he popped in on a stream. Me and Dylan, <clears throat> Dylan, were doing a while ago. And my voice cracked, Asterix. I'm just gonna talk like this from now on, Asterix. Lol. <laughs> yeah, that'd be awesome. Uh, let me see. Uh. Pierkson Librarian sent in five dollars, saying, "Can we get a uh, get Daniel and Chris in the same room and convince them that the other is a troll and watch the fireworks? It would be fascinating, but also very bloody. So I don't know if it'd really be worth it, but it'd be something to watch at least once. I don't think you'd get a second chance at it." Dark Chocolate sent in. Uh, oh, there he became a member. Cool. Maxed Powers sent in two dollars, saying, "Someone please send Cobra a can of Sir Strumming. It's happened before." Uh, but Aisha Ciodo sent in one gift. Fuck yeah. Ted Comet sent in $2 saying, Won't You Be My Neighbor is actually a Slaver song. Oh. Is it? <laughs> uh, Won't You Be My Neighbor is the song from Mr. Rogers' I Neighborhood. Know. Asterisk. I know. I know. How could it be a Slaver song, Roger. Asterisk? He's making a joke. That... Oh. Yeah, because we say neighbor instead of the, the certain word. Oh. Uh, uh, yeah, Won't oh. You Be... Yeah. I just Googled it. <laughs> <laughs> I told you. <laughs> I know it's Mr. Rogers. Then what the fuck do you think he's saying? <laughs> Fucking sometimes, man. <laughs> Swear to God. Oh, fuck. I hope someday someone just beats the shit out of you. Just bad. No, you don't. Bad, bad. No, I, I don't no, care either no. way. Uh, Bobo H man sent in ten dollars or two dollars, saying, "Where's the curly fries? The only good thing at Arby's. I don't know, man. The curly fries are just about the best thing there." Uh, Leiloni sent in $2 saying feet with a bunch of hearts. Well, I'm glad you enjoyed that fucking video. Oh, yeah. The Devil's Advocate sent in $2 saying, uh, I didn't know Elmer Fudd was a brony. That's mean, man. That's not nice at all. Mm -hmm. Damn, but, you know. Astrid, I think from now on, maybe, I, would that be funny for an April Fool's video if, like, if I could put a video out and just talk like that with an impediment? <laughs> I think it'd be so yeah, annoying. Be, uh, let, let me read it. Let me read it. This uh, this bar bar oh, one God here. Oh God damn! So, Barack Obama sent in two dollars, saying two baby <laughs> nunchucks or one Tadwa nunchuck. Urgent. Uh, I would go with the uh, two baby nunchucks. It works best. I trust your judgment, bar bar. You do what you got to do, buddy. Holbun sent in four hundred nine saying, uh, "Has the MLP writer slash director ever commented on all the gross thirty year olds of?" 30-year-olds, their little girl aimed show attracted, anything serious or condemning. Uh, some years ago, I don't know if it was her, but like uh, some like actors, actresses, whatever, were on like a panel, 
and they were being interviewed by fans and one of them asked to talk about or touch some shed some light on the darker side of the fandom and they just shot it down oh, real fast. Oh. Yeah, yeah, we watched it on stream. Yeah, they shot it down really really fast. Mm. Uh Martin Sands sent in 4.99 saying, "Hey Rogan the Goat, even though I lost 100 uh, or I lost $50 sporting or uh, sports betting today, fuck I can't talk. It's nice to know that people are stupider than me. PS Earl Doobie is a predator. Earl Doobie is a fucking predator and no matter how hard he tries, that stigma is going to follow him for the rest of his life." Rosie Maple Moth sent in $5 Canadian saying, "Hey Rogue, I'm going to redraw the Duke X Casper's uncle's gangbang. Any requests?" Uh, mm -hmm. make sure that, make sure that one of their, like, is, one of them's entering through his ass and coming out of his mouth, please. <laughs> make sure it's Fatso. Make, no, make Fatso, oh, like, fuck. popping out of Duke's pee hole. Trick, oh, Trick Star sent in five gifts, fuck yeah. Smack a tear sent in five dollars with no message, good shit. Gnome Lakey, I, I'm hoping I'm pronouncing this right, sent in 150 smackaroos saying, I got paid big bucks recently, so have this for a lovely evening, Rog and Godmom. Well, thank you so much. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. I like that. Rog and Godmom. Godmom. <laughs> the Rat King sent in $50 saying, are we close yet? I was gone. So it better be a spicy art goal. One with pizzazz or whatever the goat wants, I guess. I can't really do anything about it. Base stream as always. Here's some pre-payday shekels. Well, buddy, we have more than passed it. And thank you so much. And Destroyer of Scent sent in $50 saying, waifu pillows are canon in MLP. I'm serious. Look it up. You're fucking with me. You're, no, you're, you're lying to me. Hold on, hold on. I don't want to Google something My else tonight. My little pony waifu uh, pillows. Don't, Let's see no, 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 no. I, I'm not no. looking. I'm not. I don't have the screen on. I know, but it. like, like that, that, that is just bait. That's just gonna. That, uh, yeah, on. hold on. I'm gonna look. I'm gonna look this up. Hold on. Oh, wow. that is just a horse pussy. That's a lot of naked horse butts. Oh wait, there's there's some naked ones right there. They're just censored. That's the 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 human humanoid version of Rainbow oh, Dad. Oh goddamn no no cool. no! Cool. Look at that. No, look, look at all no. this porn, Asterisk. What is she doing with that book? That is a lot of poop. <laughs> that is a lot of what the fuck. Anyways, I'm gonna get off of it. That. that that one looked like a little kid version of her. Did you see that one? Oh my god, I don't think I want. Yeah, the to. one holding the book. I'm closing my eyes. Yeah, that. Whoever, I'm. Why? <laughs> and then Paul Bun <laughs> sent in uh, one ninety nine saying, "Hurls, who's Earl Doobie? Uh, Earl Doobie, better known as the White Bowser, is somebody that Kiwi Tapes and Smokey McCrack have covered extensively. Uh, he's somebody from technically this circle of the internet who was involved in like watching lolcow content, but he was also in private servers watching pornography with children and having disgusting conversations and possibly, possibly looking at actual CP. But I don't know about that for sure." But either way, oh, and he got a uh, he got fired from working at an AMC theater because he kept groping a girl or something. Uh, regardless, he has fucked his life up, and he is a predator, and that stigma is going to follow him till the end of times, or at least until he dies. Maybe after death, who knows? But I digress. Asterisk. Rogue. We need to look at what Art Goal won. Yes, so, we do. according to the Art Goal poll, since we have passed the Art Goal, uh, we had Chris X Golden Girls win. 42 percent oh. so it's going to be the classic image of christian fucking those those girls the the crudely drawn image he made but it's going to be with the yeah, golden yeah, yeah. girls and mm -hmm. that should be fun uh it was followed closely by uh rogue opens door halloween naked for with 29 percent. it was leading for a while it uh, was after that is rogue getting beat up by review bra which unfortunately only got 19 <laughs> percent and then we have Rogue and Asterisk, the whole Barbie Kin thing, which that only came in at 10%. I had a feeling it wasn't going to compare to the no, more raunchier no, no. ones. No, no, no. You just got to pat it out. But, but of it's course, fun to split the vote. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> we can see who who's the gayest out of the bunch. But mm -hmm. Chris X Golden Girls uh, Rule 34, I guess you could call it, is coming. And it'll be a little while. So Asterisk, when you draw this, are you going to do it in Chris's art style? I'm thinking to start the background is definitely going to be in a quick like style mm -hmm. um i don't know because i don't want to make something and then have it look like it was like yeah. a quick done thing i get you know you. maybe some elements but it's not going to be one-to-one -one. maybe for like some of the coloring or shading you could kind of lean into it at least for the color choices because yeah, use like absolutely. use crayon colors or something and like fuck up like the proportions and everything what could be like, cool is if you got a brush that looks like it was makes it uh drawn with like crayon or chalk and use that oh, for yeah, coloring. I got plenty of those. Yeah, oh, you could use yeah. that while uh, having cleaner line art on the characters, but everything still be colored that way. That'd be cool. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 
Absolutely. Oh, and uh, Joe said apparently the the girl that Earl Doobie touched at his job was 15. I did not know that, and that just Ooh. adds on to it. It compounds the pedophilia. But Good there Lord. you go. We have been going for almost two hours and 40 minutes. We've been going for a while, and it's time for us to get out of here. So, Asterisk, I need to do my spiel. Asterisk, mm -hmm. you came on, and you did what you usually do, and you know what? I think you did it well enough, and for that, I thank you. Thank you for having me. I did the thing. Oh, you did the thing, Asterisk. You most Woo! definitely did the thing. Hell yes. And thank you to everybody who spent their evening with us and endured whatever the fuck this stream was, and everybody who sent in Super Chats, they are always very much appreciated. Like I said, next week we should be doing uh, something uh, vaguely Halloween-related. Halloween, Halloween related. We'll be looking at a few things that we haven't looked at before, but I'll give you a little teaser. We've gotten a lot of requests for it, and we're finally going to be taking a peek at Andrew Ditch. So you guys mm -hmm. better enjoy this shit. Um, the High Pitch Eric video is coming along very fast now. Got a lot of recording done. It's going to be done pretty fucking fast now, I think. Uh, started work on research for the Clyde Cash video. Me and Asterisk are getting that knocked out. Um... I have selected another green text to read. It'll be a series of smaller green texts that are all going to be pieced together and tell one long story about the IT guy that could not do anything. And shit. And there'll also, of course, be another quickie reading come out in a little while, but that'll be a, uh, probably a few weeks out. But I digress. Astrid, do you have anything you'd like to say before I flip the switch and we get out of here? I really gotta pee again. Oh, well, I mean, Again. you're a woman. Of course women have to pee. Oh, my fucking but God. But I digress. I've got one more coming in from Epic Star 99 for $2 saying, come. Well, there you go. You get a little heart. There's uh, there's your come heart. But I digress. <laughs> we need to get out of here. So as always, I've got more content coming down the pipeline. But until then, I'll see you degenerates next time. We have one more coming in from Max Power for two dollars saying Earl Poopy. Who you got a motherfucker? Have a good night, guys. And, and yes, that's King Ass Ripper. I'm mode, I'm indeed, I'm dying, I'm